What's up, everybody? We're here for Big Cheese Sunday. This is Top 24 Melee. I'm Lozenge. And you're hearing the ghost of Kaiser here. There I am, right in the background. Um, I might quickly adjust that camera, but up first, folks, is uh, Luma versus Mason. So we're getting some warm-ups going right now, and then we're getting into the end very shortly. Um, how do you think this one's going to go, Loz, while I go do that? Let I'm us very know interested your thoughts. to see if uh, Luma is sticking with really the entire time. Um, the game audio is really loud. That's even louder. Survival. Right, one, one second. Survival. Yeah, yeah. The guy's just gonna fix audio. But I'm a big Mason head, so I'm gonna be a bit biased, but. I really wanna see <laughs> Icy's <see> Deke, <laughs> but I don't think that's gonna happen. Okay, so this is the start of top 24. Eight pools yesterday, top three made it out of pools. Long day ahead. So Mason's a long time ISIS player as well, by the way. Like, hella really long school. time. Yeah. All right, here we go for game one. He used to be uh, top of SA like when you saw. Yeah, basically way back in the day, hey. It's cool to see him back. I mean, I never knew him as an old school player. He joined, I think. He came back before I did. Ooh, already in The twins are still alive. Take. 
Oh, okay. Nana's gone. Mason looking to get as much as soon as possible with this stuff. Ooh, not a lot. Okay. One grab. Ooh. Oh, the blizzard. Okay, nice shit to Mason taking game one. I just gotta say, I love this venue. I think this is such a great venue that Big Cheese is in. We've got the ultimate players, like, they can stay on that fucking side. We're over here. Alright, who won that first game? Sorry, folks. Mason. Nice, thank you. Alright. I think we're all good now. I had to fix up a few things left over from doubles. Alright, well done to Mason, though. So, I'm pretty sure... If I'm not mistaken, yeah, we're all best of five in bracket today. Yeah, nice. That is the plan, so there is no van. And no mistaking Fox. Well, I really would say that it's probably the best choice in this situation. I would agree, yeah. Alright, yeah, folks, let us know if the audio is alright, if we need to turn the game or the um, the mics up or down. I think I'm, the game's quite loud, though, but I'm just adjusting that now. One interesting thing about uh, swapping characters when you're playing against Dicey's is like, obviously Mason knows the weight of every character and how to do handoffs with them, but when it comes to actually like performing on stage, you know what I mean? Oh, here we Ooh. go. Yeah, no, N Mason actually has um, good execution for this character, which is like, I don't know, I don't think this character is like easy by any like stretch of measure, right? Like, no, no. Genuinely speaking, like, uh, I remember speaking with Mason personally, like, not too long ago, about how recently what happened was Mason had, like, a bit of a break because, you know, he was having a bit of trouble with just, like, kind of staying in it, right, after being, like, so in it for so long, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, but when he came back, he decided to actually research and, like, look up what, like, all the Nana AI behavior traits there are, right? And instead of just being like upset that like she's doing stuff that she doesn't want him to, he actually went and like, you know, kind of worked ways around it so that he can actually play these partners better, right? And like you're seeing it right now, he's like sort of in control of this matchup. Mason does not blame Nana for a lot of stuff. No, he, he blames other than like just SD, like when she does just SD from like air dodging or whatever. But like even he knows like sometimes Nana as Ding is his fault. Yeah, exactly. Now, like he, that's why like I'm, I really do respect like the effort that he's put in to like get better at this character because you don't see ICs that often. There aren't many. Now we got Cookbook in New Zealand, who I think is probably the most equivalent like skill level to Mason in ICs. But then other than that, it's like. Yellow is a BB player, or just graduated. They play Congrats. ICs. Yeah. Um, so up and comers, but. It's definitely a funky character. There's also not a lot of ICs representation at like top level either. So Mason's got a lot of ideas about like the way to play neutral with ICs and how far you can take the matchup that, you know, top players just aren't playing because there just isn't that representation. Like, Slugs, you know, retired. Okay, here we go. Oh, yeah, just the F smash. <laughs> That'll happen. All right, 2-0 so far. Mason looking pretty in control. Mason but I think good, yeah. what was good there was Luma was... Actually, pick, like picking stuff up and like you know putting things together on Yoshi's. I think like going back to Yoshi's wouldn't be too bad. However, we are looking at going to Game Three on Stadium though. Unless you surprise us last second. Well, we'll see. I don't know what's going to happen here actually. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Is Stadium typically good against Icy's for uh, spaces? Well. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. As a mother, I always want to stick to the try bikes, you know. Ooh, it, the, it, five has ice there. Here we go. Still going. And that's the start. Oh, fuck. What a nice grab from Mason there. Starting with the blizzard into the firebox, which is sick. So 
something I only learned today about Blizzard was uh, you actually, the chance to get frozen is like a random probability that starts at some percent for each unique character. Like, I actually know, didn't it's know like that. A, it's what? like quake dependent. What? Yeah. No. When you'll like start having a chance to get frozen. Okay, so, that's nuts. It's fucking weird. No, it's got a bunch of that like ran random like randomness in it. You know what I mean? Like mm. peach dropping turnip. You're just like, oh, it's a random percent. Oh, the jab reset. The Soko is going crazy right now. Oh, okay. It's still Soko against Fox. Ooh, the double bear. Uh, I actually hate it when that happens. You think you have like sort of an advantage after doing a throw versus Ices, and then nope, you no, don't. You do not. There's always one of them. And Mason's so good at like when he's the one getting thrown, he still knows how to like control Nana to take advantage of it. It's fucked. Yeah, like if you're if you're actually like the one kind of throwing Ices, you have to be careful because like the goal for you is actually to use the throw missability in a way that like. You're actually sort of charging through like an ASCI down situation, but it's hard to do that in the right time. But it's looking like Mason's going to clean this one up pretty handily. But Luma makes it back for one last shot. That up smash oh, is still not doing not it. That was, I just picked up my bad. It's so funny when Isis get like hits that sent to the top because they can't follow up. Oh, nice. Well that done to the Mason. Right one, yeah, let's go, Mason. There you go. Well done. All right. So we have another game marked as well. Uh, I believe we have Monkey and Nangs. Oh, let's go. So that's a 3-0 to Mason, who will be going on to fight Goody in the next round. Ooh. So look forward to that one. Um, let's get them over. Yeah, yeah you're up. All right. Let's get it. Uh, I'm going to quickly adjust the camera brightness. It's, yep. still, too, it's still too bright. <laughs> one sec. Hold it down. There's a big Nangang contingent here. Very excited to watch Nang play. It's always crazy when there's like more Samuses in top 24 than like Sheiks. <laughs> there's like two Marths and two Samuses. And then Monkey, of course, uh, is our top New South Wales <laughs> representation. Okay, here we got Nang Gang behind us. Nang Gang. <laughs> Just chilling. Yeah, with RNG not here, Monkey is our New South Wales rep. The Falco. Lapis Decker on stream? I think they're playing. Oh, Skip beat Muscat. Holy fuck. Let's go, Skip. That's huge for fucking the whole thing. What the, what the hell? Alright, what were we just talking about? I was just talking about how Monkey is the New South Wales rep and how there's as many Sheiks uh, in top 24 as there are. I'm oh, sorry, there's more Samuses in top 24 than Sheiks. Say what? There's many Marths in top 24 what? as Samuses. <laughs> That's nuts. How did that happen? Nang's in tears. Actual. But Skip beat Muscat. Wow. Okay, I mean, look. The TO buff is debuff is like 100% real. Of course. But good job to skip though, because no, that's, that's not an easy one to take over musket. And I do imagine at least like some level of um, you know, block is happening there, because I don't think musket's probably like as prepared to fight a sheik compared to other characters. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, I know what you're saying. Yeah. And there's just not practice as well. Like, there's yeah, Dav Davin is like the goat here in Adelaide. However, he's a very busy boy. Yeah, he was here last night. I saw him, but mm. 
non-bracket. Um, Jimmo's here. Shout outs to Jimmo. Shout outs to the rat in the hat in the background, by the way. I found him at a savers and I'm like, I have to bring him to the big cheese. Cute as fuck, yeah. <laughs> So this one's going to be interesting. I think very interesting, yeah. Uh, Monkey has a lot of uh, Samus practice. Obviously with Tiered and then RNG also has a Samus. Because <laughs> Monkey has Monk got very frustrated playing. Uh, right, yeah. okay. I remember one time, like, Monkey finally beat Tiered for the first time in bracket and then yeah. went into Grands versus RNG and, lost, and then quit out on RNG Samus. <laughs> oh my god. Don't want to play it. No, I don't want to play Samus. But of course, I'm sure Nangs has plenty of Falco experience too. Yeah, no, he's 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 out there. He's out there playing against me a lot, right? Like, actually knows what he's doing. Uh, basically, if you want to, if you want to take it over um, Ruben here, you got to learn how to play annoying. Like, just straight up. There's there's no better way to describe like what you need to do to be able to beat Samus than that. And I feel like Monkey doesn't like playing annoying. He likes uh, like melee being pure. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, he plays pretty honest. Like 100%. Yeah. Um, if you're losing an angst, like, sorry, you got what? Ooh. He's looking so good right now. One difference, though, I think, uh, between Big Nangs here and Tid is that when I play Tid, like, when he's, like, going for combos, it's like he's throwing the whole fucking kitchen sink at me, <laughs> you know? Like, he's doing every little, like, attack that Samus can do, like, double jumping and, like, weaving in and out with, like, forward air and back air. And I'm just like, what the fuck does this combo end? Um, when I'm playing Nangs, I don't get that sense. He's a bit more focused on, like, escaping stuff, right? And just get, like, and getting, like, grabs especially. He's, he's, about the, he's about the grabs. I'm obviously rooting for Nangs here. What? Nice crash cancel. What are you talking about? So it keeps it simple with the up throw in there as well there. Monkey is like approaching well still, I would say. But Ooh. you can't be approaching just like with one beat off the side platform there like that. Alright, and we got the crowd coming alive. I might turn that crowd mic up a bit for you. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Okay, <laughs> just died. Ooh, so close. I reckon if I were to set up the stage again, I would have put it a bit more to the left here, but that's alright. It is what it is. So far, Monkey playing well, though. Oh, yeah, for sure. Oh, that's is, great. Cool. It's, it's Yoshi's story, so this is sort of like the, the rough pick for Samus in the matchup. Yeah, yeah, for sure. The fly guys. The fly oh, guys, man. like just getting shine at the top, like yeah. it's like having your F smashes kill reasonable percents uh, instead of just like getting owned and letting Samus live for a bajillion years. And Samus is good at getting back as well. And yeah, you just shot blaster on the side as well. But Nangs doesn't seem to mind. This is Nangs' story, apparently. It's looking Wonky. nice with it. You know, another thing I see Tid do a lot that I don't see from Nangs is like just the random bombs, just like yeah, the no, traps. Yeah, he's not he's not that much of a of a bomber. Ooh. This is even though, like I think that Monkey can still take this if he plays it the right way. But oh, oh good shine. Shine's a grab. Oh, that chariot tackle, though. Okay, Plot was smart. Nah, that's that's us. That, that That's our crowd. I got the crowd mic up hot right now. Oh! That's oh! Do that. And the shot off the top. Monkey taking game one. He, he's seen that before, actually. He's happy about that. Sheesh, okay. That was a good first game to take for Monkey. I don't think it was out of Ruben's hands, though. No, no, of course not. One second. 
Mike just got the final combo and ended all that game. But now we're going to FOD. Which I feel like is definitely a lot more of a Samus build. Oh! Nice dunk. Ooh, the up tilt. Guys, the crowd is like basically to the right, uh, left of Ruben on your screen. So it won't, like, they won't come up on the camera because of how I set up the stage, because I'm a bit silly with it. Yeah, that's the only, like, yeah, yeah. is that you can see the crowd. I was like... I, I mean, I just needed to set it up a different way. You can still hear the crowd, and that's what's important. And you can't hear the ultimate crowd, which is gathered <laughs> on the other side of the venue. Okay, Nang's making it back. Still got that charge shot. This is strangely at, like, Monkey's tempo, you know? Yeah, Monkey, I feel like, is definitely... At least in this game, I felt like in the previous game. There's more Nang's, but... Nice. Ooh, what nice down tail. Tail. That was fucking great. Samus has got really long legs. Yeah, not much you can get off that situation, but a good trade there from Monkey doing the up to it. Oh, the fair. We have huge crowd for this one. The only games that are happening... Holy shit! <laughs> there's, the only games happening are tournament games right now. Like, the, all the setups are totally barren. And everyone's come over to watch Nengs. And he's going to need the support of everyone in the building right now if he wants to bring this back. He can do it. It's just... Ugh. Playing Falco? Can do oh my Ooh, god, that's crazy! That with the bear. Okay. You see what he did was the the walk smash turn, the walk smash turn jump. So, yeah. Oh Ooh, yes, oh. that's it. Nice, love it. All right, and joining us on the mic, I believe, is Zonda. Hello, hello. Welcome. G'day, Zonda. How's it going? Yeah, good. Enjoying this set so far. Both Big games crowd vibes. Yeah, the crowd's getting very high for these two. It's, you love to see it. Right from their boys. Liking Monkey's patient patience at the uh, at the edge, but Nang's is very defensive, very good at getting back. Yeah, More forty to the face there. Yeah. Very cool calm collected there. <laughs> <laughs> There from Monkey holding center stage, forcing Nangs to come in. Looking very stoic with the shades on. Yeah, I know, I was just thinking that. Yeah. Oh, not Ooh, quite. Oh, no, he's living that. Okay. Oh, point blank. Side Fuck. Missile straight to the face. Straight to the fucking face. Okay. Monkey. Nah, okay. Great returning fire there, yeah. Keeping this nice and even. A bit too low, yeah. Set my go distance. Oh. 
Are we still in best of three or is this best of five now? All best of five today. Yeah. Top 24, all best of five. Good stuff. Ooh, he dead through the missile and packed it out of it. That was fucking sick. Oh man, this game is so close. Yeah, need the player Fledge. giving an inch right now. Oh, okay, let me... Oh, the reflector. Great reflection with that missile, yeah. Oh, jumps just a bit too close to stage and gets fucking kicked for it. F tilted into the missile too, that was a great way to close out stuff out from Oh nice. Yeah, yeah, nice DI there. Okay. Cleans it up though. Stock each. Last stock, we've been here before this set. <laughs> we've been here every game this set. <laughs> Can't go any other way. Alright. Play on the side B, yeah. Nice. Oh, Nangs capitalizes. Oh, but Monkey's back. Oh, yep, right. Turn smashes. Okay, Monkey with the initiative. Yeah, Monkey turns. Oh, off the, the top. No, the not no, quite. All the bear. Okay, Nang's making it back. And the bear, not quite. quite Nang's gonna make this back. Nang's one more chance to recover here. Oh, a oh, monkey just goes for it. Big. Yeah. Big clutch up there from Monkey. It's a pretty hard edge guard to hit. No, I bet Monkey's just had so much experience like edge guarding Samus, but yeah. it's something you for sure have to learn because it's they just have so much they can do to get back. But mm -hmm. Nang is quite good at like Monkey not hitting a lot of edge guards. So that was big. Yeah, huge there for Monkey going up. Uh, two games to one. Oh, the down hill. Oh, makes it back. So does the Falco. The classic throughout the ages. Getting okay, nice lasers. lasers. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Just a standing shooting, yeah. Oh, and the down smash sends all the way off the other side. That angle was like perfect. Mm, it just insane. fucking like scoped over the edge. 169%, kind of a gimp on Samus. Especially on yeah. <laughs> yeah, early stock there. Yeah, 100%. Monkey big damage here. Upstick. Oh, monkey popping off right now. Okay. Thanks for the grab. Oh, catches oh, the side B. Big for names. Gets a reset a bit. Much easier to cover on land than online, that's for sure. Good patience here from Nangs. Not trying to rush out the corner, but Monkey going in. Okay, nice bear resetting the edge guard. Monkey's platform work is very good. Mm. Knows when to sort of Smooth distance from the platform. Samus. Oh, what the fuck? That doesn't matter. Good trade there for Monkey. You think the, put the back air reversed? Yeah, it was reversed back air. Okay. Oh, unfortunate air dodge there for Nangs, but... Yeah, obviously, when Samus air dodges, they can uh, still shoot at their grapple, but you've got to be like... Yeah, if you're too close to the stage, it just doesn't... If you weren't preparing to, like, SD from the air dodge, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's, it's tough to then... Unfortunate that. position to be in, but Nangs able to shake it off. Pretty high percent anyway, so not the biggest loss. Monkey spacing is very good on this stage. Absolutely making use of the... Uh, Stage. Keeping Nang's very honest this entire set. Nang's rock solid on defense right now. Rock hard on defense. <laughs> okay, yeah. Nang's gonna close that sock out. 
Now he's still in with the champ. Monkey's lead's looking pretty, pretty scary. Patient there from Monkey, not over committing, but Nang's finding a way through. Yeah, that's just been the tempo, I think, of yeah, every single yeah. edge guard on the stage. Great roll there, getting out of the, the screw attack. Ooh, Ooh nice grab. Could be Nang's chance to even out the set. They're both at kill percent right now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Monkey Bear does it. So patient there from Monkey, but that flop really got Ooh, cost him. okay, doesn't have a jump. And just like All that. right, yeah, just like that. One stock each. The yeah. crowd is hyping up. Crowd going crazy. Both gamers. Ooh, great Monkey platform work. Insane. That forward there, okay, but Nang's back. Not quite costing Nang's, and yeah. No, no, oh, yeah. Oh, this could be. Okay, it's settled. Ooh. Oh, Nang's it's Death City. Something happen here, or he's going to be out of winner's bracket. Nice spot dodge. Huge spot dodge there. Okay. Oh, it's reset a little bit. Nang's ice cold on defense. Nang might building up a bit more percent yeah. here. Oh, spot touch the... Oh, okay, doesn't fully capitalize on it. Yeah, didn't quite know what to do there. Hesitated just a little moment, but... Extra percent. Kai saying could have down tilted and just sent off the top. This is so scary. Oh. Monster power for their mains. Oh, <laughs> Sorry, what the fuck? <laughs> it's been clip by it. When did you get that, it? That, that oh, monkey. fuck! Oh. Unfortunate flub there Hundred What, 189 percent mains? Is that? Holy fuck. Halfway to kill percent too, that's... Oh... Kicking FC for the final games. Monkey was just in control that entire game, up until the end, that's all it takes. Yeah, one... One flub and it's all over. It's... And Nang's defense was just so good, like living to it over 160 every single stop there. Well. Nang's ice cold. Proving that uh, hungover gaming can be accomplished. Monkey all over him in terms of pressure, but just misses the ledge hold. Okay. I'm just going to say, does that make that work? <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's starting to open up a pretty commanding lead now. Walk away for half a second and he just does so much damage. Yeah, oh, that was a nice... Nice Good angle, but Nang's look deep into his soul, past the sunglasses, hit him with a hard read. Oh, misses the grab. Monkey decides to just grab back. Oh, bit premature. Just barely with the charge shot, but... Oh, not getting the edge guard. Okay, but cleans yeah. it up. This is looking the exact same as last game. Mm, yeah, monkey keeping it simple. He's, he's showing Nang's a lot of respect with uh, just refusing to overcommit. Very, very experienced play from the up and comer here. You know what's funny about Samus is it's Samus, Marth, and Roy who have the fucked shields where it makes it easy to power shield because yep. you can like dash your way and stuff. I don't know why it's those three, but. Oh, okay. Oh! Ooh, yeah. Oh! Reverse F smash too. Yeah, the, the, the sending backwards. 
Oh, okay. That's what Maki needed. That's an early start. Monkey spacing was insane on that one. Didn't oh, no, he doesn't have a jump. No, oh, just this D's. Okay. Stock, Stock each. Yep. five. All right, this is big. The crowd is going wild crowd right is now. insane right now. I think that's... Is that a mango chant? That's... Ruben chant. Okay, every straight hit is getting a cheer. Oh, oh the down it! The monkey does it! Monkey does it! He does a little jump it. off. And he's run off. What a great Into set. It. Into the arms of the homies for Monkey. Huge stuff there for him. Big shit from Monkey there. Mm. Massive showing. Monkey taking a game five over Nangs. And every single game last off too. Oh. That's Every single game lost. You no, know, that was what a set. I mean, Monkey just showing like how good he is versus Samus. Mm. Blood, sweat, and tears got yep. up to this point. And those sort of games too, so mentally exhausting once you get to game five against the floaty. Oh, that fucking Dreamland game, just like over 160%, mm. like every stock, and then losing and then that. The air dodge at the end, yeah. Oh man. Bring it back from there. That's that's a big clutch from Monkey. Oh, but we got Ems run up. Oh, man, what a fucking set. I wonder if that was uh, what the projected was. Because I know Monkey was seated quite high for Big Cheese. Yeah, I'm not sure. I haven't looked at the seating. My uh, my phone's too primitive to run something as advanced as start, GG. Let's see. Uh, no, Monkey was seated to win that, but... Fuck. Right, that could have gone either way. Oh man, Josh already 3 0 you there. I wanted to watch that. Ooh. Good stuff, monkey. Do you want the, the mic, Kramer? I also don't know. Let's Where's tie when you need him. Yeah, yeah. Not that one. <laughs> Just click them all and then we'll figure it out. Go on my mic, Josh. Oh, there we go, yep. How can they not? Press two if you can't hear him, Chad. Let me get some twos. Oh, one, you're very loud. Oh, yeah, yeah, true. Dude, that was such a bad result. It's good to see him on. His whole attitude has changed. He's not doom and gloom anymore. Even when he got clock shot, he held it down. That was just so sick to see. It was cool, calm, collected. It had the little smirk. It was so yeah, good, yeah. Was yeah, yeah. His mentality's come such a long way, too. No, for sure. I mean, I think a lot of us remember Monkey when he first appeared on the scene. Like, he's still got a lot of that, you know, monkeyisms like uh, yeah, yeah. the mango emo posting. But uh, it's good to see the mentality. I mean, that mentality took so long to build. But Yeah, I'll stay on. You can have it. Um, my commentary is best described as Dennis Cometti from AFL 2004. <laughs> oh, yeah, for yeah. sure. Yeah, yeah. Brad, do you want to commentate with me? Sue me asked. Sue me asked you on the mic. Hand over the mic to Josh and Brad. No, of course not. We're going to swap with Brad and Josh. We do. No, no, I can do that. It's fine. Hello? Am I coming through? Talking to the... Nice.
nice crazy mic. Yeah, yeah. Put it up a bit closer to that sexy little mouth of yours, dude. Like this? Yeah, give me uh, me, 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 me. Me, 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 me. That's that. awesome. Is it beautiful enough for you? Or I need to <laughs> kick it up. Good mythical morning, guys. We got a ton of battles here, dude. Dude, we got oh, something that was a crazy there. going on. Yeah, I just looked over. I was like, oh, he's dead. He's not dead. <laughs> tell you that much. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, you can't be drilling. These guys have had some pretty epic sets. I haven't seen too many of them because I'm just I'm lazy about watching as well as playing. Yeah. <laughs> so so to me I'm like, ooh, something new. A tree. Yo! Fox Puff, yo! Oh, it's twenty sixteen. Look, I'll Ems? I had the complete wrong idea about him until we went on our grand NA adventure. And then I realized he's the goat. He's just yeah. a little he's always just down to fuck. You gotta respect that man. And boy does Ems he fuck. <laughs> Think he's about wrong. He's always bull bomb and bullet, dude. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, he's he's been real Ooh. bull this weekend. See, doesn't even react. He gets <laughs> the kill. They've been fighting like, that stock for a full minute. He's like, he's like yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Seen As that expected, one. man. Oh shit. Oh shit. So it's gonna be a little a little slower pace. We have been getting a little slower pace sets for the yeah. last two at least. Yeah, but that doesn't mean they're any less fun, dude. Dude, I'm going to allow the word fox from Ethan is away here. Yeah, that's that's smart. That's important it. to get in, too. No, like, Ron fox in his own way. It's a different kind of fucking. He, like, doggy styles, where Ems is just, yeah. like, pure practice missionary. Yeah, that's true. But, but you got to respect it. He, you got to respect it. And by now, he's, he's good at it. What's that? Know? I fear not the man who has <laughs> grinded a thousand humps. But one man one who's hump grinded one hump times. a thousand times. <laughs> Ooh. That's what I'm saying, man. Like, I'd break moment. He's going to be cracked at it. So now we can just say whatever and oh, be like, shit. dude, uh, Ethan? Oh, man, that guy. <laughs> yeah, I always thought he was a weird oh, shut up. Dude, so weird. Why is he talking about XP fucks? Come on. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's our thing. Oh, it's honestly man. cool to see Ron's just, like, development as a whole. Because I yeah. know him. We've obviously known him for ages. Yeah. Oh, early kill there is pretty massive. Yeah. Um, Ron, like, moved to Sydney for a little bit. Run his XP, by the way. Just yeah. A little <laughs> FYI. <laughs> yeah, we're kind of like really great friends with him. So, like, if you guys <laughs> talk to him, call him XP, you know? Don't tattle croc. Also, yeah, yeah, stop yeah. using an ad blocker. Do you hate Kai? What yeah, come fuck, on, man. You're, um, you're stealing the food right from his mouth. Yeah, I, I feel like he kind of found himself in Sydney a little bit. He yeah. ended up hanging out with Snurt and Tid a fuck ton, and those yeah. boys just became inseparable. Which makes yeah, me really happy. Yeah, they out the oh, whole weekend, too. Bit of a choke. Oh, oh you got to no grab roll. or something. I was reading that roll. Oh, oh and no. And the edgy, beautiful drill to pick it up, but that fair was just He's not missing do everything. It. it could be just like a first set on stream nerves kind of thing. Yeah, it's still early. First set, first game. Yeah. Puff, you can take your time and warm back up, get back into the swing of things. Wow, we are streaming at quite a low bit rate here. It's like 2.8k. Oh, shit. It's looking beautiful. How does the stream look for you, chat? Is it fine? Oh, that could be kill. Oh, that's the wrong wrong way on the C-Stick. Dude, someone told me that, like, fairing off the ledge with Fox is the Black Hawk down, and that just <laughs> kills me every time. Nice, beautiful find there. Looks fine, I'd also. Oh, I'm going to be... That's going to be stuck in my mind for, like, at least the rest of the set. When I, if I see him do it, I'm going to start laughing. That's good. It's, you've doomed me. Couldn't save it for the end of the set, man. Come on. Tell me. Uh, boom. All right, nice, I'm nice. changing song. Yeah, he's got the Veronica's blasting right now. <laughs> I hope so. He's either got the Veronica's or just the most insane white noise blasting. He's just got... He's got static. Yeah, static. <laughs> <laughs> he's got the TV on <laughs> yeah. full volume on channel 77. Yeah. Nothing on there. Nothing. Just just static and a analog. standby screen. If you tune in at 3.30 a.m., you might get some, like, some crazy shit. Amps, I think, needs to find himself. Yeah. You know, talking about Ron finds himself in Sydney. Ems needs to find himself on the stage, on Battlefield, in the game. <laughs> All over, man. Ooh, brutal get-up attack there. Yeah. Barely clips him, too. He was trying to float over it, for sure. Yeah. Every rest oh. changes the channel. <laughs> yeah, Puff's down B, definitely the universal remote of the setup. Yeah. It just it chooses a random channel too. It doesn't Dude, go to like the next one. Oh the DD! Oh, oh, oh great nice, SDI nice. there. Yeah. The dash dance from Ronley right now. Yeah. He this knows he's at kill percent. He doesn't want to laser do anything else. He's like, I just need that up throw up air. He's got one last one in him. 
No trade too, no, which is pretty nice. Yeah, that's that's pretty big. That's when the back air starts going. Ouchie, my man. Yeah. Oh, honestly, as Puff, you're kind of loving this percent specifically. Yeah, this is when you're turbo chilling. Yeah, because now you really get like Fox has to struggle to find the kill. Sometimes he'll just up tilt hit. over and over that though. That move quite busted. It's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie Down to smash. you on this one. Damage. Oh, gotta get your dammy. Oh fuck. Oh. Oh, Ems is kind of beasting on him in the corner right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, he can't get out. Couldn't get out. Down throw? Yeah. Oh, yeah, just gets the slide off there. Yeah, it was close, but down throw is so unreliable sometimes. Becky. You just fly. You always want Uppy there. Gotta Uppy. Ron really looking yeah. rule ramen reluctant. He's just Scooby Doo posting right now. <laughs> no jump. Fuck, that was brutal. Yeah. Do these nairs are kind yeah, of Ron beast? Yeah. Ron's looking for the raw up smash oh. a little bit too much too. He can like dash dance a little bit more and wait it out, but just lets Emps One close more out chance. the stock. Oh, yeah, nice. beautiful coverage. Yeah. Pretty right. tough to live there. Yeah. So if you're Emps now, you're just truly not trying to get up smashed or grabbed. And unfortunately yeah. you've been grabbed, but you got it doesn't matter on your to side. Him. He's just crazy. He'd be wiggling that stick to the left or right. Oh! Nice, nice. Oh, Chickaloo. Yeah, yeah. That was a good with punish. Pop. Very good. Catching onto these overshoots with an air Emps is doing here. Yeah. I'm surprised Emps isn't fishing that hard for like rests and that kind of stuff, you know? Yeah, we haven't really seen that many, honestly. Yeah, it's fishing for that aerial game, you know? Do you want to turn? You're down to hop on. I gotta play soon, probably, anyway. Yeah, we can hop on for a bit after. Do you want it? Here's SA Nick. SA Nick is stepping into the booth, ladies and gentlemen. Sorry, guys. It's okay, man. Is that not the mic? Which is, uh, testing, testing. You sound good. <laughs> uh, yeah, give us like a static oh, buzz. You're just, yeah, hell yeah. Hey, uh, welcome everyone to Big Cheese. Yeah, Four. welcome to SA Nick on comps now. <laughs> They've already been welcome to the Big Cheese. They've been watching the set. Yeah, well, welcome again. Oh, oh this could be the one. I can't believe Emps didn't. Oh, oh he's choking. He's, yeah, he just, <laughs> he's floundering. Emps is like specifically looking for that setup and he just yeah. go for it. It's crazy. Oh, he's actually, he's Yeah, he's out. terrified. He's actually terrified. But you know what's terrifying? Going off stage to try and hit Jigglypuff. Yeah, so. yeah. Yeah, I think Ron's perfectly fine oh. to just chill there. That sucks. You see, holy crap! Did you see Emps yell <laughs> after? Nice. Yeah. After he's feeling it too. After up B, uh, beat drill. Yeah. Yep. Emps was just like, "Fuck." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's definitely a fuck moment, though. He, he, I, you know, don't deserve, not deserve, whatever. He deserved yeah. that. Like, he had the move there. It's kind of some Fox bullshit. What are you going to do? It's like all drills in this game. If you hit them from below, they don't have much priority. If you hit them from the side, they have like infinite priority. Yeah. I don't really understand why they made that choice, but... Just the way it is, you know? Yeah. Too many choices. They're bound to make some questionable ones. I mean, Jigglypuff actually has a lot of trouble not trading with Firefox. Yeah. Yeah, it feels like back air is the only reliable option. Yeah. And even then, you have to be in the right spot for it. If he's underneath, you're never hitting a back air, you know? Nair actually usually wins. Yeah. Uh, Nair also, because you can basically, my philosophy for recovery and edge guarding in, in Fox Puff is like if, if Puff is facing you, up B is better. If Puff is facing away from you, uh, side B is better. Yeah. Because Bear will like beat most fireboxes, yeah. but uh, it's really it's slow. A, yeah, to it's a, a bit slow to, to be trying to cover uh, side Bs with it. Yeah. All right, gamers, I'm back. What's hello, up? Hello. And um, the scores are correct, right? It is 1 1. Yeah. Fantastic to hear. One, one. Dude, banger after banger this tournament. Actually. Yeah. No, this set's really good too. Not gonna lie, like that. me and Coffee could have been a stream game. Because that shit was like, uh, it was like a storybook set actually. Uh, yeah. He went 2-0 he went up and almost beat me 3-0. Oh shit. But I clutch. Yeah, the, the, uh, the experienced player takes it in the end kind of beat. Uh, he just was out punishing me for like what, three games straight basically. Yeah. And then, um... Coffee can get a little crazy with it sometimes. Yeah, like, I took him to FD on one of the games I lost, so he, he didn't have it for when I did win a game. And then the next two games were, like, Yoshi's, and I won both. I'm like, awesome. Oh, Great shit. Yeah. All right, yeah, those are some sick nares. Yeah, nares, like, again, one of the fastest moves. One of the only moves that'll beat side B and up B. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's one of the moves where, like, you know, you're playing your secondary puff in 2015, you start using it, you're like, why don't people use it? And yeah. guess what? You're correct. They should have been. Same with uh, Drill back in the day. Why yeah. Why do we use this? 
It's like, man, maybe when they're 150, I can drill grab. It's like, brother. Drill the the, the world's your oyster. You actually can't do shit at 150. That's wrong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm just saying back in the day, they, they you know, just get like, knocked oh, over. What do I do? Yeah. Drill doesn't stop working once it starts knocking yeah. over. Generally. They, like, bounce out or whatever, yeah. right? Okay. Nice. Amps used to spam full hop drill. Yeah. That was the... You haven't seen it too much. I remember that being Ooh. the end school. That was clean. So quick to recognize he hit it. Yeah, usually you have to dash up smash there, but he just yeah. faster and Ems did not have time to react to the eye. Yeah. Oh, he drilled and then just got out of there, which is yeah. super risky because I think every puff always shield grabs up the drill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just good EV to do on shield. Yeah. Ems did an up smash out of shield earlier on it too, so like, yeah. he knows how to shield shit. Well, drill. Like, isn't good on shield, so you should yeah. always shield grab it as possible. Yeah, yeah. It, like, most of the time, you can get a shine out, but it doesn't really matter if you hit off a shine most of the time. Yeah. Yeah. And it's like, you gotta be frame perfect, whereas the, the puff, you can just mash that shit, you know? I mean, you don't. I mean, it's not. Even if you are frame perfect, uh, it still, still It still grabs, yeah, yeah. yeah. Saying like, the time when it doesn't. Like, one out of three times. Yeah. Or whatever. That time, they can still mess it up, be a frame slow, and you're, you got them. Speaking of God, I'm, Speaking of frame data. Speaking uh, of game four time. And Emps is shaking his head a lot. I think Emps is playing pretty sloppy this set. Yeah. He's not hitting edge guards. Yeah. Um, yeah, we were just talking about that before you came on. Is that he's not resting either. He's like trying to look for setups, it looks like, but he's not going for it. Or yeah. he's just not looking for setups. He's looking to do the, the old aerial game. Yeah. Emps has always been one to play like super safe, I think. And then it gets to like game four and five, and he realizes he has to clutch up. Yeah. And, uh, he starts going for those <laughs> crazy setups. He's just always setting himself up for the clutch. Yeah. He's got his he's got his pop off decided before he gets to the venue. It's like choosing out your outfit. That was such a great find with the outfit. Yeah. That was. He just slid right in there. Caught him. Ron's super smart, and his his like main weakness as a player is like. His punish and like specific defense isn't always that good, but yeah. like as puff, it's so neutral based. The combos are so like yeah. Uh, uh, Ron. Ron. XP. The combos are so like limited in what you can do that like if you have it, you can figure it out. Oh, great SDI up. Yeah, that's clean. Um, yeah, SDI up super good. Uh, SDI to the side usually needs to input this stuff. Yeah. Um, it sort of depends on like percent and positioning and everything else. So like if you're able to recognize which one's better, then uh, it's yeah, massive. Puff's fat. Uh, and the way that like SDI works as Puff a lot of the time is if you SDI up, you can like do it at the time where you would be able to jump out. Yeah. And either you jump or you get the SDI. So it's not like super as timing dependent as. Yeah. You get to like option select it. Yeah. Yeah. Puffs back in that percent oh, where you gotta look for the crazy finishers like up tilts. It seems to be Ron's go to at the 120s. That was the Ems, by the way. Was that? Just uh, bombing it there. Yeah, the absolutely bombing it. Box. You gotta do it sometimes. Uh, it's super risky at 120. Yeah. You gotta respect it though, you know? A lot of people are like, oh, bombing theirs? That's, that's that was, Fox shit. That was a great up air by Ems. Yeah. Oh, you have to hit that. Oh. Okay. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> I don't, yeah, even then, I feel like Ems could have like dropped down bad instantly yeah. and been better, but... Had a lot of options, but uh, closes out anyway, I mean, works out. It does work out. What would you do if you were uh, a member of the crowd right now? I would probably be screaming, uh, go on, because that's my boy. <laughs> but okay, I, I, I can't say that, you can't be biased, no. Yeah, I mean... Also, a lot of pound sitting. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. And yeah. custom at such annoying spacings where it's like. Yeah. That was ambitious. I always feel like I've outlasted the pound that I ever have. It's kind of like Muff's counter. Yeah. It just lasts for so long. Much longer than it looks like it should. Ron's hunting. He's trying to find anything, but he doesn't want to put himself in a spot where he's going to get hit off stage or arrested or something. Oh, go for the jiggly poke. Yeah. <laughs> it's a classic. Yeah. Now he's at like a percent where uh, he's got no setups. Yeah. Yeah, that's what Back I was here, saying. not going to kill yet. Every time that happens for Ron, he's been killing with up tilt. See if he starts bringing it out again. But um, 
yeah, you kind of you're a bit owned at this percent. You're like you got a back air and hoping kills. You got to try and hit a crazy up tilt. Up smash. Yeah, just you. You're basically stuck to doing random stuff. Yeah, that was the up tilt that he's been getting killed with. Good to see him avoiding it now. You know what no one does except Whoa, Mega? Oh, how did that reverse? What's that? Maybe left it. Like, wave dash forward jab. Yeah. Yeah, because then you don't, you know, you don't have to go into run. You don't have to go so far for the jab. Alright, he's trying to look for his rest. Nice. Good find. First rest of the set, too. And that's when you want to pull it out. You're 130, you're like, I'll die to a light breeze. I gotta get this, I gotta get this uh, game finished. It is crazy that it's the best of the set. Yeah. Uh, again, it does tend to clutch up as the second set. Yeah, yeah. I was just kind of surprised seeing him not really uh, going for rests, going for any bolds, you know. High percent, like, my stock is over, let's see if I can finish you off kind of deal. Hey, uh, KP Kaiser. Great crouch cancel, not so great DI. Are we going to see Skip Geordie on stream? What do, you, what do you mean? Like they're set? Yeah. Ah. Yeah, that's what I want to look out for, too. Nice. That was a uh, quick yeah, stock too. Oh, yeah. Nice. It'll be next. Cool. That'll be fun. Maybe all my friends can win. But yeah. only one of my friends can win, that's it. Yeah. Oh! oh! The wave dash back? That's so. That's such a cool way of hitting that. That's so slick. You're and, such a cool guy when you hit that. And Ron nearly hit the uh, death combo on the punish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, weak nair to, like, some bullshit to up tilt. Uh, up air? Yeah, at the start. M's okay, that's it. Oh, oh, you oh, have to hit that. Yeah. Claw uses hit a uh, single hit. Oh, there. easily. And box uses. Exactly. And that. just like people try it out now. Oh, okay, I'm scared. Yeah. Ems is hunting and Ron knows, and they're both terrified. Well, Ron needs uh, something. Yeah, he needs a finisher. Ems is basically out of up throw up every percent. He needs something crazy now. Oh, uh, Ron's fishing extremely yeah. hard right now. It's so much harder to fish without the platforms too. You need to be careful. I can't make it so obvious. Emps is looking like he is very nice. Right now. Crouches it. I thought he crouched it too. I was like, he's going up so slowly. Maybe not? Yeah. Uh, a little late on the oh, I can up to him. Yeah. Should we poke? Yep, <laughs> yep. I'm going I'm to see it. Yeah, that's scary. Yep. <laughs> the USIB was coming, but... Uh, yeah. Okay. Ron's well, letting this slip away now. One more yeah, chance, he makes it back. Possible. Yeah. Got a jiggly poke, though. <laughs> and Ems is going to be kicking himself if he doesn't clean this stuff up quickly. That's yeah. a pretty free edge guard. Yeah, that's the scariest part of Puff. When you get to live that high, you kind of feel privileged. And then you die, and it's like, okay, I can die in three hits again. Yeah. But Ron can die in one hit as well, and now he's down. Last stock. The, uh, the freaking sucker champions, as they say. They do say in that. Australia. Whether I like it or not, they say it. Oh. Okay. Oh, he could have could have been ready to jab reset. He just wasn't, you know. A running, uh, running something. Yeah. He's a nest string to like an up smash. He just needs to get away from the spacing where they're at right now, or I'm just throwing out moves. That's it. That's, That's it. yeah. That's, That's basically a roll. Oh, he's could finish it off. Yeah. yeah. It's gonna be done. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> and Ems has exploded into the. Ems getting some crazy airtime leaving the stage. A lot of pent up energy in there, and uh, yeah. a lot of potential energy uh, converted into kinetic energy. Very quickly too. The stream not a high enough frame rate to fully capture it. Yeah, yeah. Um, it's it all a big blur, you know. <laughs> exactly. He's just moving so, so fast. So gang. I want to get your opinion. Do you guys mind waiting like five minutes? Because I'm thinking I might move the whole projector setup to this side so that the crowd is actually in the shot here. You know what I'm saying? That's not a bad idea. That's that might be more hype. That's what yeah. I'm saying. Do you mind? Get, do you mind holding it down for like five minutes or so while I do yeah. that? Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Thanks. That's a sick idea. I'll hold it down for ten minutes, man. All right, Brad. Plug uh, it. <laughs> thank you. We're gonna play categories. Uh, the the subject is. Australian melee players. All right, how's it, how's it work again? It's been too long. I just say like A, and then I say a melee player that's from Australia that starts with A. Okay. And, and then, then you know we have a little know. story about each of the players. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, I'll start. Wait, Kizza's name is Alucard, right? Yeah. Alucard. Legendary old school player. That's a classic uh, guy. That's someone I'd like to meet if favorite, I uh, start going to more stuff. One of my favorite dead play personalities. Yeah, he's all over that shit. B. Oh. Uh, bruh. Uh, hmm. Uh, I don't know. This one's a bit hard. Uh, I actually am trying to think of someone other than Brad, so I can, you know, I can complete the bit, but I'm striking out. What about what about chat? Yo, what is up, Soul Tekka? Berenger. I'm a big fan have, of you. I haven't met Berenger, even though he's Queensland, because I haven't been going to locals. But uh, you know, he's around. He's <laughs> have around. You, have you uh, interacted with him at all? I don't know if he's come to anything interstate. I mean, I haven't interacted with him, but the ripples from Berenger have been felt far and wide. Yeah. Uh, through primarily flood esports. Oh yeah. Legendary esports. Yeah. Team in classic, classic esports saga. Uh, see Kato. Beginner beatdown player? Yep, yep. Very slag Falcon. Yeah. Um, unfortunately, didn't make the big cheese. Yeah. That's how it goes sometimes. That's how it goes. Yeah. Very friendly. Uh, mm. D. D. Mm. Uh, oh, of course. Dekar. Who could forget? Who could forget? Except for me for like 10 seconds. <laughs> and Kato is in stream right now. Isn't that crazy? Oh, there he is. Hey, man. Of uh, Australian Melee right now watching us. Everyone's here, whether they're, you know, in the little TV screen over there, computer screen, or they're out here in this beautiful fucking auditorium. Yeah. And uh, I'm thinking about E. I'm thinking about E right now. There's got to be some good E's. I feel like E's a, a fantastic I'm, letter to have a tag. I'm looking around the room in desperation. Yeah. I'm looking at the stream chat. Oh. Emps, he's walking right at us. He was just on stream. <laughs> just on stream. I, I have the memory of a goldfish. We're, I don't know what's going on. Stupid, man. I so watch. dumb. Emps, one of the most energetic uh, players. Definitely. It's always so fun watching him in a set because at least it, you know, even if you're like, oh, this set's boring, blah blah blah, floaty versus floaty or something. At the end, you know you're gonna get a treat. Exactly. Even if it's Emps versus the Samus. Yeah. Uh, like, oh, I've been here for 25 minutes. It's time for the payoff, baby. It's like when you do like 30 minutes of study and then you treat yourself with a little bit of chocolate. Uh, I know, love you, doing that. You sit there, you watch the, the floaty by Samus, but you know there's something at the end. Yeah, there's a light at the end of the tunnel, and you can't wait. F. F. Mm. I've learned that when it comes to thinking of things on the spot, I'm awful. I can't think of anything. What kind of Fs have we got around floating? Uh, Frank. <laughs> I was going to say Frank. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> Legendary Mario player. Hell Old yeah. Old school. Uh, I feel like if you're a Mario player these days, you just gotta be old school. Either that or Doctor, you know? And Fess. Yeah. Fess. Oh, of course, Fess. Okay. It's it been too long since I saw Fess. Or, like, heard from Fess, obviously, in ages since I saw anyone, but. Flowey, Flowey, of course. Yep, yep. Uh, Fess is nuts. I don't know if people know this. Uh, I've actually heard Fess. that. Uh, one time he hit uh, Edge Cancel, single hit up air, into Edge Cancel, single hit up air. Really? Uh, up air. And come off it. And How does that like, even? It was oh, like, off, like, he, like double jump like, the second one. It was off like Dreamland side platform or something. It was like, yeah. And then comboed. I was like, this guy. That's sick. And he also just... maybe the best handball player to ever do it. I haven't work. played handball with any of the uh, any of the fellas, but I've I've only heard like you know, Fess is nuts. I've only heard it extend to handball. So you gotta. Uh, you gotta expect it's pretty cracked. I uh, we should potentially get a Foursquare set up, organized. Um, that could be fun. It might be, it might be a. I don't know what the weather's like today. I think it's a bit cooler today, but we had a, we had the footy yesterday. Yeah, yeah. It's been overcast the whole time, so as long as it doesn't rain, it should be fine. Totally. Yeah. yeah, there's plenty of spots to play it too. All right, all right, chat. All right, Brad, we're up to G, and uh, this one's a personal favorite of mine. G Money, aka Gareth. Ooh, that's exactly what I was going for. Exactly. I keep looking over; he's floating around. That's my dog. Dude. He really brightens the room. He does. He's so like. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's the only one I can think of, uh, to be honest. Yeah, I'm sure there's others floating around, like with all the other letters, but they're just so overshadowed by the, uh, the lovely soul that is G Money. As a player and as a person, exactly. I think Gareth is probably the, the most notable just, G just a, name. Just a pleasure, pleasure to be around. Uh, right, what comes after G? H. Smart. I really know your letters, man. I'm actually a bit of a categories pro. 
Yeah, armor category is noob. Yep. Level 100 category is noob. Uh, level uh, uh, 1 million uh, category is boss. <laughs> <laughs> I get kicked down the mountain, I have to fight the little like fishes and they kick my ass. <laughs> exactly. So level 3 fucking like goldfish just eats me up. Uh, Johnny Two Fingers, exactly. Uh, G. 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 H. H. Helium. Oh, I thought Johnny Two Fingers was spelled with a G, man. My bad. Johnny Two Fingers. Yeah. See that uh <laughs> that clip of that? Oh, this is an extremely niche clip. I saw it on Media Watch. Like eight. Like I'm pretty sure like uh I saw it retweeted by like Patricia Carvellis or something. Like an ABC news reporter. Yeah. So no one will see this clip. <laughs> you have to paint the picture. For but us. it was like one of the one of the candidates for like. Uh, New Zealand Prime Minister just like not knowing how to spell cat at a preschool. <laughs> he was like, K A T, what does that spell? <laughs> <laughs> That's so awesome. That's like an insane bit if you're not like running for Prime Minister. Um, well, what are we doing again? H. H. It's helium. Uh, helium. I mean, Helium, one of the best modes in the, in the country. It's so impressive. Right up there with Yetos, which I'm just a massive fan of. Yeah, I cannot wait till we get to Y. <laughs> uh, H and Y, the uh, the Mo brothers. We're an I, which is you. I feel like I might not know a single person whose tag starts with I. Stuff. Yeah. Any Oz melee heads? Any uh, Australian ethos in the chat right now? Ipcat. Ipcat. That's, that's a deep cut. I've, yeah, I've heard the uh, I've heard that name floating around, but uh, I don't I don't know anything about that person. I want to say a boss player from the beginner beatdown uh, academy. Yep, academy is such a such a funny and good way to to phrase that. Yeah, they're learning. They're beginners. They're at the academy. Very as an S player. Pretty basic. Keeps it keeps it simple. Stupid. Keeps it 100 even. Yeah, exactly. Man. Uh, Jay. Jay, uh, I was going to say Jordy, but that's kind of cheating. And I can't yeah. say Johnny Two Fingers, but that's already been. So yeah, I guess we'll have to say Josh Man. Yeah. yeah, there's too many. But is Josh I wish Man we could have really said Josh Man from Sora, that'd be funny, but it's just not his name anymore. We didn't say Goody for G either, that's pretty funny. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's so obvious. Yeah. Jam he didn't get overshadowed by, uh, by Gareth, though, so. Yeah. It's just like we said. Tish. <laughs> what was he kissing? Uh, my, ch my chin or my neck or something. I don't know. He kind of like went down there. I was like, I gotta go with this now. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so we did I. I don't think, uh, I don't think Tish Jordan would be able to handle a public it. rejection on stream like that. Yeah, like, I, had like to, I had to give it right back to him. I don't know if he could take it. He's strong of spirit, but uh, strong of soul, but strong of spirit, I'm not so sure. Yeah, he's weak of spirit. He's yeah. strong of brain, for sure. <laughs> strong of mind. Strong of brain. Probably, um, uh, I'd say like a medium of body. Okay, K. Okay. Well, so we got Josh Man and Jamwa. Jamwa, uh, we'll tell a story. Uh, famous Ness player, low tier hero. Yep. yep. Uh, always makes it down to the big cheese. He's been into climbing recently. Yeah. One of the best hat wearers uh, and most long tenured hat wearers in the Australian melee. Yeah, I've seen some good hats. He looks like a protagonist of like Pokemon or like Earthbound. Yeah. Uh, I still remember uh, it was Jamal, right, who uh, lost to Sam like all those years ago. Uh, Aura, like Final Destination. Maybe. There, there was some story about that. I actually can't remember anything that happened. I just know there was one. You better not be a fun story. You better not have no, I think it was just like... Uh... Alright, let's speed run. KP yeah, yeah. Kaiser. L. Uh, Lozenge was on commentary earlier. Oh, okay. Uh, I haven't met enough people. McLeod. McLeod, uh, yeah. Looking stunning today. The, yeah, that, is that a Syndicus dress? Yeah. It's a... I, I don't actually know, but I was just going to say it's a It's a nice looking dress. I was yeah. waiting to talk to her and say like, hey... And Fitz looking fresh. And Nangs. Nangs. Who could oh. forget the Nang gang? Who could forget? The most vocal group at the uh, at the function. Unfortunately, uh, fell short against Monkey. Yeah. Uh, it was a fun set regardless. I think uh, even the Nang gang would be pleased with how that overall went. I'm struggling for O, I'll be honest. O. Um, 
Orange Man. I don't know. Orange Man. Classic Falcon player. He's uh, He plays Orange Falcon, and uh, he's crazy. Ollie. Is that Shaky in the chat, by the way? Brad, can you read that? that uh, shaky? shaky FGC? Yo, Shaky. Oh, shaky? I, was, I, was, I was talking about you, like, three days ago. I don't remember about what. Probably about the original South Australian PR that had an SSS tier, an SS tier, and an S tier. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Uh, P for uh, play melee. Because we're about Ooh, to play, play melee. Time. The uh, freaking right, we are time. Set. Oh, I gotta sit up. I gotta, I gotta be ready. Be All right, thanks for joining us on this uh, little, little detail. This little journey from A to P. <laughs> what, what was the score? You lost a lax. Okay, whatever. He's gone. Whatever. He's sprinted away. He's a big man. He's got big wins. He's got to go strut his stuff. Oh, they're going straight in? Oh, All yeah. right, let's do it. Yeah, no one they have been hand warming the whole time. No one wants to see one of these two get eliminated by the other one. Yeah, of course not. Two fast friends, yeah. the best of friends. This is this is a team kill of like a whole new level. It's not just Vic on Vic. It's like fella on fella, you know, pal on pal. Just two fellas right now. Yeah, palling around. Hotel sharers have to you know fight to the death. Yeah. And uh, you know, we love to see the melee, but we hate to see the matchup. At yeah. least in terms of uh, tournament life. We love to watch him play, but we yeah. hate to see him leave. Oh, exactly. Oh, we, we, we hate to see we, one of them <laughs> leave. <laughs> something, something. <laughs> love to see one of them walk away exactly. victorious, struttingly, and we hate to see the other one. We However, like, they we like to, to watch leave. them leave. That's the one? Uh, I actually have no idea. I've thought about this a lot. It's, it's uh, I hate to see you go, but I love to watch you leave. Yeah, that yeah. sounds right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I guarantee, like, next week when I remember that saying, it's going to switch around in my head. It'll be like, is that it? <laughs> uh. And right, Skip, nice. not a good Arms Attack user. Yeah. Uh, I think that's a spot where Arms Attack kind of, uh, she doesn't slide off in time, right? So, no, like, you can just do another one? No, not Down Smash. Oh, okay. Down Smash uh, is long. a little too slow. Yeah. Okay, so you that can makes often sense. get a shine off of it, but that's, like, the fastest option. Right? Yeah. Shine's not really going to cut it, especially at that percent. Yeah. Alright, yeah, true, true. You know Jordy's uh, pretty in practice. Yeah. I was playing him earlier. I'm very out of practice, but I could tell he was, uh, you know, he's definitely working in some tech skill practice, some this and that, and I was like, damn. He's working on the. My boy's the on it today. Out of shield? Oh, yeah. He's getting some nice shines on shield as well. His movement in general, very clean. Very yeah. Clean. He looks ready to go. He's been playing PM since uh, 10 30 as well. He's in the PM bracket. So he's, you know, he's plenty warm. Yeah, Jody has that uh, that same factor where he just wants to get to the venue and grind all day. He just loves to play the game. Uh, there's, uh, there's an argument yeah. taking place next to us. Yeah, Kai, you know, Kai's struggling to TO and run the stream. I don't can't, expect, him. can't expect him to do it all, you know. He's got to love this play. Yeah, yeah. All right. Um, I like blacked out for the last 10 seconds. I don't know what happened in the set. I was gonna say, you know, Skip wants to close this stock out, and he did. So now, uh, he wants to live. Well thank you, thank you. And he instead dies. Unfortunate. Oh my. That was a really good idea. Yeah. I wonder if that's like a setup that he's like toyed around with. I don't know what it is, but when I watch Mango do that down air and then run back to try to catch the roll, he gets it and no other Falco does. Like yeah. everyone else, someone gets a shield out. He's just the fastest in the biz. Yeah. It's crazy how like no matter what, you can somehow, some way always get faster. Alright, inside. The legendary <laughs> doubles winner is I. Uh, yeah. Taking some nice happy snacks around, happy snaps around the yeah. venue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't wait to see all the photos and stuff. I gotta be more of a photo guy with my phone, but I'm too lazy. Are we doing gambles, by the way? That could really take this stream to the next level. Yeah, we gotta <laughs> make sure the, the people at home have a way to, to get some endorphins. And, uh, what's the other one? Dopamine out of this. Yeah. Serotonin. Exactly. Dopamine, whatever. All the good ones, none of the bad ones. Uh, Jordy won that game. Uh, yeah, yeah. 
It was a bit of a slobber knocker though, you know? I don't blame you not knowing who it was. I know. <laughs> Looked like it could have gone either way. Ooh, great choice yeah. for the weak man. That's good, yeah. That's the uh, that's the lovely part about playing Falco, is you can kind of just love tap him, and yeah. uh, he'll fall to his doom. Also, the weak bear, uh, untackable, so... Yeah, yeah. No escape. Alright, just get freaking out a little bit there. Yeah. Could have been, like, uh, an enormous, really instant lead. The great recovery as well, that's, uh, yeah. that's one of the many J-moves. Yeah. To me, that's always the, uh, the Anders recovery. So okay. I played him one sesh, like, two hours, this was ages ago. He did that to me every time, and I was like, I just can't beat it. I'm not smart enough. To the Lord Anders? What's yeah, the Lord, the Lord Anders. Anders. <laughs> That's the one. <laughs> it's so good. Love that Lord Anders has been forgotten by the sands of time, and yeah. been replaced with Lord Anders. <laughs> As it should be, if you ask me. In terms of, like, who has revolutionized Sheik more, it's definitely Anders. Yep. He's... Mind, body, and soul, and body chic, you know? And speaking of uh, body chic, crazy F smash to uh, clean out that stock. You like that one? Yes. Thank I you. thought long and hard. Yeah, and it's definitely brought like an aggro approach to chic. That, yeah. Uh, Sheik's the He's most aggressive really one to do it for sure. Ooh, great coverage on the roll. Jordy yeah. loves between stocks and rolling. Yeah. Woo! Timid! Crazy! I. I'm shocked. What, what a kooky move. To this day, I still don't understand quite how it works, but I'll take it, you know. Yeah, Sheik really bends the rules of what a hurtbox and a hitbox can be. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, yeah, that sucks. Skip, I came out so strong that game. Yeah. Kind of choked a pretty easy edge guard for a two, like, stock lead. And, yeah. And uh, really crumbled, unfortunately. And Jordy, he's just playing clean. He's, he's locked in today. Yeah. Yeah, Jordy's playing so clean, and uh, Skip... He's playing clean as well, it's just a lot harder with Sheik. And uh, it's a, a little bit more out of practice than Jordy is. A little bit, you know, this A lot that. harder with Sheik. Controversial thing. Yeah, Hard, <laughs> harder to, uh, to make the cleanliness work in this matchup, I should say. Interesting. I think uh, Jordy is, I think. is just like way more in practice. Yeah, that's the big that's the big piece. Like he's just playing puzzle. better. And also uh, sustained a little bit of an injury at the climbing gym yesterday. Yeah, so yeah. Yeah, I meant to ask after he played a bit, like, how's it feeling? So I hope it's all right. I'm sure it's uh, at least, you know, not bad or he wouldn't be playing, I hope. Never know these gamers, man. Yeah. Fiend it too much. Oh, that sucks. I thought she could live that. I yeah. Not. I think, um... Yeah. I don't know what I was going to say. <laughs> Oh, great the eye from Jordy. Yeah, that was sick. Oh, great trying to shield from Jordy. All right, nice. Fell with a pretty bad back air. Probably could have just on the shine out. Skip it's a bit slow on the, yeah. on the CC punish. But yeah, it's uh, a bit slow. That works out for the, the CC and guy in the end. See that full battery, by the way? 15%. Every needle hit. Minus one. Because isn't it 17? Maybe it was stale. I feel like it was a It could have been stale, yeah. I wasn't looking to see if he was blinking or not. I think the way Staling works with Needles as well is as the move is out, the Staling is added to the Staling team. Yeah. Okay. Uh, which means that, like, the fifth Needle will be a little bit stale. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if there is Staling already, the Needle's going to be hella stale. Yeah. Needle has some weird interactions. Like that one where you, uh, like, ground a Needle someone and they hit, and then you get pushed back onto the ledge for some reason. Yeah. It's uh, there's so much weird, like, weird interactions like that that are just like, you see them once in a while, but it's like, what the hell? Yeah. It's like, yeah, dude, that's just chic shit. Chic shrouded in mystery, much like in the game Ocarina of Time. Yeah. Um, much like she is wearing a bit of a shroud as as we speak. Whoa! What an egg. Okay. <laughs> Jody wasn't ready to how good that ang was. Jody hit a crazy yeah, ang against me and Frendes. You know Jody doesn't have notches, by the way? Every that's, ang he hits is so natch. He doesn't, he doesn't seem like a notches kind of guy, too. And uh, Jody loves like run off uh, there. He would be morally against Ooh, it. He's clean nice, with nice. it. Jody's not going to let you just squeak back on stage. He's there. Jody's, Kinda look at He's there. He's that quick. Yeah, Jody's in practice enough that he gets one extra move per turn. He's got yeah. the perk from like RPGs where you have like... Some, some extra action points. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You have to, like, do an extra. Yeah, I was going to say, Jody loves... Uh... Oh, I can't... 
He's gonna win. Actually. He loves winning. Yeah. He does love to win. <laughs> he loves uh, platform tech chasing by like waiting for the tech roll to end and you just shield and set up for like the shield slide off. Running yeah. past the shield, shining. The old school west balls. Yeah. Uh, but like he's always aware of the possibility of doing that. Yeah. And it like beats slide off uh, a lot of the time because. Yeah. Most people are ready to get hit out of their tech roll, but not to get hit out of that shield situation where you've already yeah, pushed up. Yeah. Honestly, like, frankly speaking, out of all the stuff you can take from West Balls, that's easily the coolest. To, like, you know, run them stuff. off the, the platform. Yeah. He had some good stuff. I just think that one's the, uh, the coolest out of all of them. I remember back in the day, uh, Genesis 2 Grands, uh, when Mango did run off, like push off, jump back to stage, down yeah, smash. Yeah, down stage. smash, yeah. I think it's like a terrible option in hindsight. It was so, <laughs> he was so <laughs> slow with it. He was just sitting on the ledge. Yeah. So hyped though. He was so awesome. Dude, I love the crowd in the... Yeah, this is so much better. The enormous, the bleachers filled to the brim with uh, expectant gamers ready to watch another... Yeah, and it's only going to get more and more filled. It's as, actually yeah. way better, yeah. That's true. There's a lineup outside. If people start to trickle in, the, uh, the bleachers will fill up. Yeah, because there's still people like playing sets, doing whatever. I see Josh and Kai playing over there. Ooh, that's a scary set. Yeah, that could have been fun to watch here as well, but only so much time in the day, you know? I wonder who is next. All right, so we got up to P in Sky yeah. Stories. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Q, Quetz. I don't think we did P. We didn't do P? All right, well, I'm saving Quetz. Um, P is a... Uh, there's got to be a P. There's so much dead air because I can't think of a P. MFW, I cannot huh? think of a P. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I'm, I'm stumped for P. P skip. Napoleon, yo! Oh, of course. <laughs> How can we forget? How could? Well, that that's almost an E, Emperor Napoleon. That's a, that's been the catchphrase of this it. whole. Uh, how could I forget? Yeah, how could I forget? Yeah, it? that's it's the one. <laughs> I think that's just been the catchphrase for our game of categories, dude. Well, that's been the highlight of the stream for me. Is it McLeod Lax? Ooh, oh, a storied rivalry. Yeah, you know this rivalry dates back to itself. when. Uh, so, back in the in the online only era. Bundun had an event. Uh, it was like a... I don't, I don't remember what they were called. It was like a fight night. Yeah. And after Who the knows? fight night, there was like a surprise uh, doubles, like two intruders trying to take the crown. Yeah, And I was yeah. supposed to play doubles with McLeod. And my setup team. wouldn't work. My internet would not connect. Oh, uh, yeah. It's and so Lax had to sub in for me. <laughs> and I've never seen anyone 1v3 as hard in doubles as McLeod did. Lax Dude. was just getting in the way at every possible turn. Doubles is McLeod fucking hard, managed man. To, <laughs> McLeod managed to still clutch it out. Doubles is hard. When you're yeah. a fast forward, you got those lasers that you keep hitting your body with. It's like, man. Falco's the easiest, the easiest guy to fuck up in doubles with, I think. And I guess what I want to say is, uh, despite these two being friends, I think something deep-seated within them yeah. makes them want to fight, even when they're on the same team in doubles. I think it's buried all the way in there, and I think any set between the two of them, you know, with something like that in their history, it's going to be... Uh, Exactly. It's going to be bloody. McLeod always remembering how Lax was not pulling his weight in doubles. Lax, uh, now she's a like, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pull you off stage and I'm going to hit you with an air and a turnip. Exactly. And Lax just saying, I don't care who it is. I don't care who's on my team. I'm not here to make friends, is what Lax is saying. <laughs> I'm not here to make friends and I'm not really here to win doubles either. I'm just kind of here. Yeah, I'm not, I don't know why I'm here. <laughs> I just kind of showed up. Uh, I forgot how I got here. <laughs> it's going to have like a, a little tag that says like, my name is Lewis. Here's my address. McLeod looking like classically 1920s style elegant right now. Yeah. Elegant's such a good word for it. I keep looking at the dress. I'm like, man, yeah. that goes so hard. Maybe I like satin or something too. Some nice looking material. Damn. Yeah, I mean, I've been I've been enjoying the word elegant ever since uh, Welt. I've been on an elegant walk. <laughs> For those of you in the chat who are uh, who have been initiated. Jordy started saying excellent walk. 
He, he like doesn't. Yeah. He's not, he's, a, he's not a fan of the. The word elegant. The the whole the whole bit. Oh okay. I wish you said the word elegant. That'd be so funny. Be like yeah, I'm not really about it. There are certain words that Jordy cannot say. Give me one. Elegant. Um. All right, give me two. Uh, he never says week. quit. He never says die. Yeah, he <laughs> like the energy <laughs> <of> the money. <laughs> Man, we, we should have thought of that earlier and saved it for the set. Now, Jordy, he, notoriously, there's a few words he can't say, but I can't really remember. Oh, man. Bit of a crazy one coming up. I think McLeod is going to win. Hot take. That's pretty hot. more in practice. Lex, uh, one to get a little down smash from time to time. Yeah, from time to time. But you can't help it, you know. Lax is a... Uh, one of his main skill sets is being really good at trading with Falco. Yeah. Uh, as, in, not, as in trading as Falco. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, most Falcos, once they get hit, it's this spooky time. Lax yeah. really good at, like, placing down airs at percents where, like, if it trades, he's still... It's not a big deal. Like, he's not going to die instantly for it. Which means that, like, in this matchup, it's a little yeah. scary for him because, like... McLeod's gonna be looking for trades. Yeah. Peach is just a character that's built for trades, so if that's like your specialty as a player, you're kinda just gonna get rocked. Yeah. You need to like pull out some other shtick. But first stalk, you know. If we're Lax going by the first stalk, then Lax is winning. Extrapolate this. Story. It's like when you uh when you start day trading. Yeah. You make like a 1% profit day one. Like, and you're I'm like well, if I make a 1% profit every day, I'm going to be a millionaire in like two months. Yeah, it's going to be so day, easy. So. <laughs> make a 1% loss in one day, you're like, it's over. My life savings are already gone. Exactly. Well, you're like, yeah. no, I can still win this back. I got this. <laughs> what if instead of 1% loss tomorrow? No, no, no. no. The, the trick is you never, you never stop on a 1% loss. It's true. You can't yeah. end on a loss. That goes for everything. That's kind of nice. Yeah, he is. What? Uh oh. Okay. Here comes the McLeod punish. Uh oh. Yeah, Peach Train. He's going crazy. He's going schnutz. Uh, you know that uh, that Cat Stevens song, Peace Train? And, yeah. Uh, we are the Titans, or remember the Titans? <laughs> what about Peach Train? Remember that? Oh shit. Hey, uh, yeah. Anyone in chat? <laughs> That's good, man. <laughs> you should write that down, save it for later. <laughs> uh, McLeod is super. Uh, Good power shielding. Yeah. I'll say it. Yeah. That's good at power shielding. Notoriously, actually. Yeah. I would say that's like, you know, Lax's superpower is uh, trading or whatever. I'd say that's her superpower. Is power shielding random shit. Yeah. And then you just die. You're like, what the fuck? I'm in the, I'm in the blender. How yeah. did I get here? Also a classic uh, box peach user. Uh, she's very... Very good at like all the subfloat bullshit, all the yeah. shit that you shouldn't really be allowed to do. The fucking ledge dash, the pedge dash that they're yeah. calling it. The pedge dash is ridiculous. I was gonna say outside of that, the, oh, uh, the get box cold peach out. is sick. When you get called out of your side B with a forward air, you know you've been yeah. predictable. That was so long ago, you know? Exactly. She made that decision like, you know, yesterday. And yeah, uh, McLeod kind of running over yeah. Lax right now. Yeah, it's kind of the uh, the floaty situation where it's really hard to kill them. Hit the down tilt. That's uh, that's like one of your few kill moves without like an edge guard or something, you know? Oh, not getting the dash iron. That could have been money actually. Oh, no CC oh. on the down tilt. Lax is still in this, bro. Yep. Oh, <laughs> so smart. He just knows. All right. Oh, I was. It was on the tip of my tongue. I was like, "All right, the next thing I'm gonna say is like, Lax is playing this nice and like patiently, not rushing it too much. He just falls, falls with a back air. That was one of the it's worst back airs. Yeah, it was terrible. It's like not facing the right way. It's never gonna hit anywhere. She could have not been like crouching, and it would have crouch canceled almost. Yeah, do not try that back air now. Yeah, don't try it, even if you are like a trained professional. Just don't. Exactly. <laughs> Yeah, the, in, the the risk of injury is real. Yeah. Regardless of your stance on, you know. Yeah. I, I do not say the the the. the 
<laughs> the F word, but I was like, there are too many questionable F words and not enough people watch wrestling. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that could have been a disaster. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to have to... Uh, Nick actually has to go now. He just got a phone call. Uh. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, you hate to see a combo start there if you lack, but he gets out. Almost a kill. At least with Yoshi's, you can hit some shines, you can hit a kooky up air or something to kill. You have plenty more options. Yeah, there's opportunities for BS on this. Yeah. Uh... Yoshi's is such a fun stage if you're about that BS. And you know Lax is about that BS. Oh, he's so about it. Do you reckon uh, forward facing up tilt is ever like good on shield? It might be, right? Because it like hits super late. Yeah, it'd have to be like some weird like read kind of thing. And Lax got the ang there, but uh... Not yeah. The ledge snap held down. Too little, too late. Yeah, and I think McCloud's just gonna win this through attrition. Uh, yeah. You really have to be so clean around these. Yeah. Right and I feel like not to not to say Lax is not clean. He's definitely got his tech and his combos, everything else. Okay, you say it. I won't say it. But um, it just sort of seems like the way he's trying to play against Peach is not really gonna. Not gonna do him any favors. You know it's another bullshit box pitch uh, trait. I can't wait to hear it. Doing that like really low sub float and always being able to hold C stick down. Yeah. I mean you can do it on conch obviously, especially with Z jump, which is also a little bit. Yeah. And definitely. claw, which is fair. <laughs> and people who play claw, claw legal, put in everything hours. else illegal. <laughs> I mean of course claw is legal. I I sacrifice my damn hand health. Best That's believe true. I'm gonna. Yeah, that's the cost that comes with it. I and then they come soul. out with all these fancy squares. And it's like, what did I sell my hands to the double for? Lax getting squashed. Yeah. Lax yeah, looking like lost. Like he doesn't belong here. Yeah. Like he's questioning why he even came. Like his hands might be sore from bouldering yesterday. Yeah. That's what he was thinking yesterday. He's like, man, why did I do this? Like, you'll be fine, man. What's a little, you know, what's a little gaming with some raw hands? You'll, you'll be fine. I know everything, Jake. Don't worry. Mm. I'm your guy for, for base takes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Crazy start Let's for... Let's get a uh, weak net there. Yeah. Yeah, Lax just can't get anything going. I was going to say that Yoshi's can also be a bit rough if Ooh, you're... Oh, uh, needed to down air back onto the platform there. Yeah. My IMO. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, if you're rumbling and tumbling with Peach, uh, Yoshi's can get scary. Cause you're always up and in there. You gotta make sure you really don't fuck up. Stop doing that back air. It's in yeah. there. It's trolling. You're gonna need a new. You need a new fucking stick, dude. You need a new bit. Exactly. Back air is getting not real fucking old. You. Yeah. It's played out. The people want something more. Oh, again, falling the top level with back air. Yeah. It's, it's greedy, it's impatient, it's and disrespectful. It's, it's greedy, which is fine sometimes, if you get a reward out of it, like when it hits. But there's just nothing to be gained there. Yeah. Peach is at like zero. It's just like, it shows that you don't respect your opponent when you do a back air like that. Yeah. It's wrong to do. Yeah, it's frankly, like, I would be upset sitting next to him. I'd pause the game, I'd say, I'd it's say, offensive. do you hate me or what? Like, like what are we doing here? Like, why, uh, uh, do you want to play me? Because, like, we can just call it. <laughs> Ooh, and I don't like that. I feel like uh, Lax, if he was Armada, he would uh, he would drift in such a way that after he hit a down air, he would be ready to follow up. Yeah. Even if he was Mango. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta be ready for what comes next. Even if he was yeah. SA Nick. <laughs> you gotta have like the next that. step ready. Dash attack's a bit scary, but gets away with it. Ooh, just barges right in there with the with the down. Yeah, uninvited too. Exactly. It's so disrespectful. Alright, that's just a kill too. Damn. That's the Yoshi's, dude. McLeod really wants to grab Oh, oh insane oh my edge god, dude. That's the genius That was move. fucking crazy. Hits Dude, of the forward air came out, but McLeod yeah. was still ready to shield drop after the third and get punished. That's the uh, game sense. You gotta be ready. You gotta know. Okay. Here comes the uh, 
Oh, what a Josh call early. Is that the, the forward or is the Black Hawk down? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they got me good. Oh, oh, oh that was like the last snap. pixel. That forward was smash the pixel. is over Peach's body. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Oh. And Lax is just going to fish for back air. Say, oh, really good way, Yeah, Lance. that was great. Brave. Now he's starting to think about where he's placing these back airs. Okay. That's really good. And that's one really scary thing against McLeod in particular. If you come down with that back air, it's not like power shield does match. Yeah, when you're coming down from that high, too, there's not many timings you can do. So, like, the power shield oh. gets easier and easier. All right. What, what's... Uh-oh. Oh, oh, oh no. just gives up the edge guard. He's like, I'm not fucking with that. Yeah, okay, that's it. Nice, nice, good. McLeod's still in this. Yeah. Black uh, uh, I, I know you meant. McLeod, McLeod <laughs> might have a chance, okay? I'll say it. Yeah. I'll say it. There's a chance. No, it's definitely, uh... Yoshi's is, uh... A big, um... What am I trying to say? It's a big stage for Lax to now be through with, and now he's got to move on to FD. And I'm looking at the chat, I agree. The F smash was crazy. I, I don't know yeah. how Falco fully, like... It was like a choreographed, like, uh, dance moment it's where like one guy flips over the other guy like <laughs> it's the brutishness of falco versus the elegance of peach dude she just crouched under it like it's nothing exactly the plan was like uh like neo the matrix <laughs> <laughs> nice yeah Man, it's such an annoying height for Falco to deal with. You don't have laser uh, platforms or anything to uh, to help you either. You kind of just gotta wait for it. Also, Kai, I reckon you're gonna want to switch the cameras around on the scene. Oh yeah, I didn't even notice that. There it is. Nice. Lax won the last game too. All right, perfect. All right. Scary. Considering how that stock started too, Lax getting 90% after afterwards, it's pretty good. Yeah. That's that's what you need. You need to make it count because once you get grabbed, it's it's fucking pound pound for you. Yeah, I really hate this stage in this matchup. It's just like not a fun game. On this yeah. Game. And there's no like, there's no combo routes to like super. Like, yeah. Like the top the top platform shine stuff that you can do on Yoshi's is like super rewarding to go for. Yeah. This is just like you. Simply have to keep winning over and over again. I, I, you kind of yeah, up. there's no combo extensions you can you can hit as Falco. No. You just have to go with whatever you can get. And Peach, uh, Peach be extending. Her yeah. Combos, uh, Peach can do whatever she wants. This is like a playground for her. We we just see a flat stage, but for her, she sees like the monkey bar. She sees the swings. Exactly. And she's like, like, you know uh, what? I want to take Falco on the on the slide with me. It's like in Zelda, again, a bit of an Ocarina of Time guy today. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> where, the, where you have like the lens of truth. And yeah. there's like platforms that only one, uh, only you can see. Yeah. And Peach can see them. And she's, you know, she's dancing on them. She's doing the waltz. Yeah. Falco's Lack, just Lack like played the, the, being the thrown around. played the treasure chest game and he won 10 rupees. <laughs> uh, McCloud played and she won the lens of truth. And uh, the difference is showing. Yeah. Yeah, this is definitely highly truthful. Highly truthful gameplay. Ooh, like ships in the night, those two dash attacks. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, back into our loving arms. I don't think he was dead there. He kind of gave up. Hey, Lex, I think this is over. I'm gonna no, say it. no. We got this. Look, nice shine. I also called you Lex, but your name is Brad. Yeah, look. I, <laughs> you, you're getting a bit mixed up, but I'm, I'm picking up what you're putting down regardless. This is still not undoable, right? But it's it's like you said, you just kind of have to play so well. You have to win so many interactions. Oh. It just gets so scary. You get hit by a random oh, shit like no. that. <laughs> you fucking tumble off of the stage, yeah. and it's uh, it's going to be a wrap. Yeah. That's kind of a, a sucky way for it to end, but it's... Yeah, I mean, McLeod it was, it was just... Coming. Yeah, it was coming. Yeah, it was a long time coming, I want to say, you know. As, as mean as that's... Uh, Sounding now that I've said it, I just mean you know, from the start of the set, Lax was looking a little bit shaky. And yeah, well played to McLeod. Uh, yeah, she, she was playing is so well. Very solid. Uh, one of the favorites to, I'll say it, come second at this tournament. <laughs> <laughs> All good.
It's gonna be on, oh, the, good, on, the, on the mic with Zai. You know Ashcon has met the members of the yard? That's fucked up. I thought those guys were like not real. Yeah, I'm gonna get Ashcon's autograph at this tournament. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna Trilly's he's gotten their autographs, so like I'm gonna ask him to imitate theirs. Yeah, can you forge uh Aiden's signature, please? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do like a little love heart at the end. You know Aiden's signature has a love heart. Yeah. He's got it on the eye for sure, but I'm saying, you know, get some extras in there. <laughs> Uh, Deca, pretty good at this matchup. Yeah. Uh, these guys have a weird... I feel like Deca swings too much, and Emp doesn't rest enough. Yeah. And they both play kind of scared against each other. <laughs> That's true, yeah. You know Deca used to play buffs back in the day? Back in the oh, olden yeah. days? Back in the dark times. Oh, speaking yeah. of doesn't rest enough, finishes him off straight away. Yeah. Off the top two, not even a not even a little jab or something for a bit of percent. I think Emps is better at this matchup than Dave. I'll, yeah. But Dave is like a... He's just a cracked gamer. He's a cracked human and like tournament presence. Yeah. Yeah, sitting next to him, you're like, oh shit. Here we go. I'm really in for it. It is like a, a real treat to be able to play Dave in tournament. It's like yeah. such a quintessential Oz Smash experience. Yeah. It's your little uh, rite of passage. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, but oh. he's dead. Yeah, that's gonna be three back airs and a missed forward air, so he's actually alive. And you're a bit of a liar. No, he's, he's actually dead. dead. You're kind of a truther. I, I'm a I'm a Jigglypuff truther. Yeah. Okay. Jigglypuff's got a lot of truths about her too. Yeah, you gotta read that roll away. You know he's gonna roll away there. That's yeah. A classic roll away. But I guess like a lot of people will mash up tilt there. Yeah. It's scary too, once you're at that super kill percent. If you're not like primed to be like, I'm gonna go for a rest or something, yeah. you kinda don't wanna go in. You're like, what if I'm too slow? And once that creeps in, you kinda just, uh, you're paralyzed. You're just sitting there. Sitting up. Exactly. Waiting waiting for him to come to you, and that's not what you want. But Dave's gonna have to be careful about that roll in the future, because Amps is, uh, cockney on. Yeah. All right, no, uh, no tipper, no, you know. If Epps is uh, cotton on, then what is what clothing brand is Dave? Ooh, he's gotta be something like nice, but like not, you know, not crazy, like you know, designer stuff. Yeah, it's like an ancient M or something. The <laughs> world <Well> industries. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, that takes me back. Yeah. Oh man, this uh, this is not looking like a, a great first game for Dave. Yeah, Dave's getting pooped on. Yeah, he's getting a bit poopied on. Okay. All right, that is Tim not quite it. Good DI from Amps. Yeah, it was great DI. Dave, yeah, he's definitely just uh doing a lot of moves. Emps is just, uh, he's trying not to get hit by any moves, Woo! so... That was good. Yeah. He knew. He saw it coming a mile away. He's like, I'm gonna up you. Fuck it. Dave will read you if you do something. He's a little big. reader. You gotta be schmixin. That's what I always say. And Dave's kind of coming alive. It's a little scary for Emps. Oh! That's gonna kill. How did he yeah. find that? Yeah, you can feel a the momentum moment. change sometimes with Dave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sometimes he has to get all the shitty, like, swings out early in the set, and then he, like, starts gaming. <laughs> and when he's gaming, he's a gamer. When he's gaming, that's where he wants to be and where you don't want him to be. You don't want to let him game. That's when you're in the danger zone. He starts hitting you with these crazy side Bs with a million No, hits. rest out of shield. Oh, man. Oh, no four day hit? That's crazy. Oh, oh, and he just gets the back air out. This could be a yeah, kill. No! Oh! Oh! He, he ran what are you out doing? 
And that's like, Davis hit that tip in one million times in his life. One million. Probably. Yeah, I think that's just probably true. He's played so much. Oh, and he's dead now. Okay. Oh. Right. Oh, yeah, it's so perfect. He knew. Okay. Yeah, you don't oh. hit that, you're dead anyway. <laughs> okay. I can't believe he's clutched this oh. so hard. Dude, I, it feels like any hit's going to kill him. Yeah, like one up there. Like oh, that's going to do just it. just a forward tilt. <laughs> Oh, okay, bad. I'm just gonna forward tilt, I guess. Why not? That's it, I'm F tilting. I've had it up to here with your floating around the stage pink pink ball bullshit. Yeah. This is absolutely swatting amps away like a like a little bug. Like a fly, like a you know? Disgusting little bug. Like a beautiful, cute little insect. Beautiful, cute, pink, spherical little fucking bug. That's disgusting and I wanna swat it. You ever look at um Bees up close. Bees? Yeah. Uh, I think so. They're pretty cute. They're so cute. They're so cool too. Ems is kind of BS because he also vibrates. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like Ems will probably enjoy like beekeeping. I feel like Decca is in a little beekeeping right now. Yeah. <laughs> All right, you got me, man. Nice, <laughs> nice one. <laughs> That guy with a smoke gun right now. Yep. Uh, kind of unethical, to put him to but bed. doing what he doing what he has to. Do. Anything for that sweet, sweet honey. Yeah. I'm gonna put something in our in our freaking tea. Exactly. Oh, now Yetta's on the little dolly, wheeling people around. Oh. I wish Ems would like rest out of these situations a little yeah. more often. Yeah. He needs to be throwing out the rests. Just be pumping out the jams. Yeah, it's like it's a lot harder to kill with a rest punish as uh, Mark. Plus, Dave's not going to be doing like fancy pivot shit. He's hey, going to uh, be charging a neutral B. I have a question for you, by the way. What's up? Uh, where did I leave my phone? <laughs> hey, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Just so uh, so helpful. <laughs> Oh, and oh, no he rested. That, was I a, that was a risky oh, Sorry. Rest. Actually scary to uh, recover against the last as well. So yeah. You can't recover underneath the sword. Yeah. Well, maybe there's like an up B like, sweet spot where you can do it, but I never see anyone successfully do it. Yeah. But oh, what a scary pounce. to swing there as well. Oh. That was almost like the cleanest edge guard I've seen. And Dave's swinging a lot. On Throwing out moves. Guards. A little scary. Oh, what a insane oh. dream. An insane rest to go for as well. I respect that so much. Hit or miss, that's badass. I mean, it was just a punish on an F match. Like, you should be hitting that. Yeah, well. You know, Clutch God hits that. Ma Mango? Yeah, hits obviously, that. Clutch God hits that. All, all I'm saying is that uh, he's starting to break them out instead of, um, you know, trying to, like, back air it or something like that. SA Nick hits that. I trust you, man. <laughs> Don't worry. Big card? Look, do Definitely you want, do you want me to take it back? I'll take it back if that's what you're trying to get me to do. Well, I'm just trying to so show some respects to these beautiful gamers to on the, screen. To the vision. To Unfortunately, the vision. it's not enough to just have a vision. All right, All right I take it's it back. It's not about what you say, it's what you do. It's what you it has the results that uh, are created as a re as Look, man. Look, I take it back, <laughs> man. It's fine. Emps with a pathetic effort to try and rest him out of shield brutally just owns his own self by missing. Look, all I'm saying, Brad, is the pop to hell is paid with good intentions. All right. I, uh, there's nothing you can say. There's nothing I can say. All right, you got me. All right. So if you're gonna hit the rest, good. If you're gonna just like, I tried my best to hit the rest, then what am I gonna do? Compliment you for it? Good hey, idea. If, if he's the hey, one, next if, time. If he's the one saying that, fair enough. I'm just saying like, hey, good job going for it. And Deca, say that's epic. Oh, that nearly killed. That was nearly the worst DI ever. He just went straight. He straight up went horizontal. Oh, and Deckard standing there saying, come at me, bro. Oh, I saw the startup of an up tilt there, too. That could have been a stock going the other way. I know. These are the margins. It's the margins that we're playing at here. They're standing on a razor's edge right now. Exactly. And that razor's edge does a lot of cutting when Dave's involved. It does. It, 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 oh, that's a rest as well. But he oh. gets the F smash. He doesn't have to suffer the, uh, the humiliation of being taken a rest punish. Yeah, yeah. The indignity. I feel like it's a it's a dignity if you uh if you hit the rest. <laughs> it is dignified to yeah. respectfully take the rest punish. Yeah, it's like a 
a, a deal at like a pawn shop, you know, you shake hands afterwards. Take a little percent, you take a stock. <laughs> Pleasure doing business. Yeah. <laughs> I, I receive one stock, you receive 40%. Yeah. <laughs> Only one party's happy, but you have to shake hands anyway, because exactly. that's the respectful thing to do. Not always can both parties get what they want. The exactly. Party. Someone has to compromise. Otherwise, everybody leaves unhappy. And Decker finding it. A magical Decker pixel. Decker <laughs> is the best in the world at finding the pixel above his head in Moth S Smash. Yeah. He's just, it, it, like, why is he trying to up smash that last game, you know? Just up smash, you'll find it. Exactly. You'll get there. Exactly. Uh, real ones who have watched uh, Miles Warehouse 2 will know that he's actually the king of that dinner. Yeah. And this is, like, meaning a little bit to Dave, I think. He's uh, had a bit of a pop off through that after that game. And it's, like, big in the context of the set. Yeah, yeah. Winning a Dreamland? That's big. That's so big. That's huge. I feel like Dave, as a player, probably doesn't mind Dreamland too much, though. He's happy to, uh, you know, Ooh, no get amongst it. Just gets it. Yeah, it goes low. It's, uh, it's an up here. Yeah. Woo! Oh. All right, he's trying to... He's trying to do cool guy stuff. I feel like Dave can only truly find the deck on magic if, like, the situation falls for yeah. And he's 2-0 up, you know? He can't force it, you know? He's tapped out of magic for now. He needs to recharge. That's just gonna live oh. there, yeah. Yeah. It sucks to see friends. But you know, you still got him at a million percent. He's in a nice solid back air. Watch him fly off. Dave's gonna somehow live this. I don't know how. No, I know. Did he use his jump? Did I miss that? Did he, he use did. it straight away? You gotta, when you get like sent off at high percent, you gotta just mash jump, because otherwise you'll die. Oh yeah, because you'll just keep floating. <laughs> <laughs> now that's a dignified missed rest. You yeah, take exactly. yourself out. <laughs> And if it hits, it's just straight up cool. It's cool guy shit. Oh, what a down air. That was sick. Emps is moving at 1 million miles an hour right now. Yeah. Hitbox after hitbox. Just an onslaught. He, just he's a barrage. Moving at 1 million puff miles. There's only so much the character lets you do, but he's, he's at that peak. He's, uh, he's reaching... What's like a... What would you say? Like, max 3 speeds? Yeah. Uh, well, not max like 7. That's fun. Yeah, probably, I don't know. Uh, probably he's like a, going a, into a crisp overdrive. 100 Ks per hour. He's a uh, hyperdrive? Yeah, yeah let's overdrive. <laughs> I, I feel like hyperdrive is like the crazy next level one. I feel he's at overdrive. Yeah. They've just been trading percent this whole set too. Every time I look down at the percent, I'm like, what's the difference? Oh, 3. Oh, 5. 12. You know, this is one of those times that I wish I watched anime. Because I feel like those people who watch anime have such a good way of expressing like uh, levels of speed and or power. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, me, uh, I'm like, speed? Okay, what's like a really big number? <laughs> exactly. It's like, oh, he's at 100. He's, go he's going like 125. See, that's not even a big number. Anime guys, they know about a billion. Yeah. They know about like a they are, They don't even know. They don't just know about it. They're familiar with it. <laughs> They've been there. They've been there They've multiple seen times. <laughs> They've seen the billions, they've seen the two billions. Oh, he's... Okay, De Dekar is... He cannot keep going back to that well. Yeah. He hit the best roll read ever uh, well. in doubles yesterday with that wave dash F smash. And he's got big ideas now about yeah. it actually being like a, a go-to. He's got big idea, I think. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and you hate to see a tournament winner there. Yeah. Because that's like a, a reversal that Ems did not get. Yeah, yeah. Alright, you hate to see Puff living to 200 as well, but sometimes that's the way it is. Especially on Dreamlands. Don't really have easy ways to kill as well. You gotta take what you can get, you know? Oh, that was close. And that's uh, cleaning it up. As yeah. always, beginning to clutch up as the set progresses. Going for more yeah. rest, going for more risks. He charges himself up. He's like winding one of those, uh, he's like a, like clubs out of your jack in the box. He's like charging himself up. Exactly. Winding himself up. Like a watch. Yeah. As the time progresses, the watch number, the numbers on the watch get bigger. And you know he's missed a and couple so of rests, he. but uh, even a broken clock is right two times a day. After the set. Hell yeah. Crazy. I completely lost my train of thought. Oh, good for that. Yep. Nice. Dead. Oh. oh. That's like the last frames. There's an up tilt coming. There it is. Yeah. 
This is the part where you start spamming any move that will like send up or towards the side of the stage you're on. That's it. Yeah, nice. It's insanely fortunate trade by Dead. Yeah, that Trades was... with like one hit of puff down air it makes the uh, side B up feel true. Yeah, it's just oh, and so not... fortunate. That's the little, a little sprinkle of magic, you know? Oh, great oh four what a four recovery. there. That was so and good. Yeah, I still in this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it's hard to edge guard Martha Puff. Yeah, and it's Dreamland as well. He's still going to live. As long as he's not DI'ing bad. You ever watched Zane edge box? Uh, it's not hard. a while. It's hard to edge guard Martha. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Because he gets, yeah. he gets swatted away. It's like, what can you do? You're so slow, you can't get back out there. Oh, and Deckard's landing the shield, not ready Ooh. to get the punish there. Air dodge? Marth killer. Yeah, oh, nice. and he gets the stage, doesn't get a ledge. I think he lives this. Yeah. Another swat? <laughs> this is where he's building up most of his damage, this dog. He's just swatting him. It's so annoying to take damage like yeah. this as well. Oh, yeah, that's the DI that's going to kill him too. All right. Ooh. Game four, and Deckard's going to have a smaller four. stage, but uh, I mean, no matter how much you like your counter picks, it is nice to wrap it up real quick. So, yeah, you do lose a bit of momentum from your opponent winning on their counter pick. Yeah, you kind of just uh. Holy oh crap! My. I'm in the whoa. I'm in the th thx zone. And Emps is oh, he's he's a good scrapper. He's resting. It's game four. He's breaking him out. Oh! Oh my God! Dave's tipping. <laughs> That's a Moth Puff moment. Yeah. <laughs> no, when you're up in a plane, that's exactly what yeah, this feels exactly. like. All right, apologies for the freaking ten yep. delivery of these games. That happens, that happens, you know? Yeah. Oh, good drift. Oh? Ooh, oh, what an F smash. smash. That was so good. That's the manga. You gotta hand it to the OGs. The manga combo. The manga it combo. <laughs> Ooh, weak net. Weak net is so scary at zero. You yeah. can't really see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm pretty sure it's oh. Zacharias even off uh, ASDI only. I really thought he was gonna rest there. I was like, holy shit. Such a perfect setup for it. Ooh, I thought he was gonna up tilt shield poke because he's grabbing his head. He even tricks tricks the commentary booth. Commentary Ooh, seats. Great choice to pound. He didn't have any other option there, and Deca probably tried to get up down uh, down there, there, but okay. Ems is so locked in right now. Yeah. They're both locked in, man. Yeah, both Dave's got in a the game zone. to play with, but um. Yeah. He doesn't want to waste it, and he looks like he has kind of thrown it away here. Yeah. When you have a game to play with, it, it feels nice when you go in, but once you start getting clapped on your counter pick, it's like, this doesn't feel so good anymore. Do I have to change something up? Like, was it just this game? What's going on? You have to, like, yeah. really soul search. But Manson is a crazy thing in Super Smash Brothers. Yeah. Dave, though, he's got he's got so much experience Ooh, that he's, right? uh... Great from Ants, actually. He's doing the the anti mom where yeah. you wait for Moth to swing with a move and then you do a move. You He's doing the, the fighting games. Yeah, you it. wait for your turn. <laughs> okay. All right. And MTI did so hard. He got some in drift at the end as well. Yeah. And managed to like avoid the zipper. Yeah. But Dave is uh fishing for some crazy shit. I thought an S-Slash was coming there. It hit. Oh, oh right. right over it, too. I don't understand how he ended up down there, but he's fine. Oh, no rest. Yeah. That's free. That's a free rest. There's nothing he can do. He's he's still crouched down, getting up. All right, good drift. Yeah, I'm going to go for rest that will just straight up finish the game. Yeah. This, they're the freebies. Those are the ones you can practice an uncle punch for hours and hours. Never miss a big tournament. And you know, Amps can die at zero to a tip off the side of Yoshi. So yeah. Find a way to DI out. <laughs> uh, but doesn't get a chance to, to find his way. Instead, you know, just wins. Just I'd say that's preferable. And we're going to stadium. Yeah, switches up. That's uh, That's understandable. Giving something else a try. 
smart. Nice to have some space. He was doing pretty good on Dreamland. Uh, yeah. It's just that. And Muff's get up deck is better than Puffs. Uh, don't true. let anyone tell you otherwise. I believe it. <laughs> I'll trust you. And we just saw that in action as well. Like, uh, the proof is in the pudding. The proof is in the eating of the pudding, I believe is the correct. Is it? Yeah. No way. I've never heard. I've only heard the proof is in the it's pudding. It's like the proof of the pudding is in the eating. You know, I. That's crazy. Yeah. Well, if you thought it was the proof of the pudding, you had another think coming. Thank you, man. Thank you for that one. That was great. Ooh. Great. Oh? Yeah. Too fast to get hit by the, uh, the side beat, uh, I thought this, I like I knew the side beat was coming. I didn't realize that. Oh, what a call out! That's the big card. Yeah. F smash. Just F smash. Not like out ledge, ledge. Not anything like that. Just F smash. Yeah. That's fair enough. It's got to be someone's. I mean. And the thing is, Deckard, the games that he won, he clutched so insanely hard on. He's gonna yeah. be thinking, is my game plan actually winning, or am I just clutching? And can that be relied on? Yeah. He's Ems is clutch too. He might be the clutchest guy here. It's true, he might be. And that's also just not a thought you want to be having. You want to be thinking, yeah, I'm cracked. I got it. I got it like that. If you're starting to think maybe I don't, then uh, it all starts to crumble. Deca really did like teach me everything I know about mentality. For better <laughs> or for worse. I don't know if you were around in the old days, the dominance days of Deca. Uh, no, not the quite. Triple D. That was like right after. But uh, you'd ask him for advice, and he would say, yeah, he's going to exhibit confidence and dominance in the setup. That's good advice. And it's true. It, I used to go to locals, I would think, dominance, dominance. I'm not going to lose a single friendly. That's good, that's <laughs> good. And then you do, and your world crumbles, and you're like, well, I guess I'm shit and worthless. Yeah, when you play Muscat for five hours, and then one hour in, you lose the first friendly, and you just kill them for the next four <laughs> hours. Like, my day is just ruined. My night's fucking over. Not a sustainable way to live. Yeah. Anyway, as we're, as we're talking about fucking whatever, <laughs> Dave <laughs> gets his lead. Finally back up, looking to uh, win on his counter pick. Close out the five game, uh, the fifth game. Here's hoping for uh, Dave's sake. Ooh, great spacing by Amps. Mm. And that's like, yeah, he's giving up the ledge way too easily, though. Yeah. Ooh, that was also by Dave. Gives up the ledge, doesn't quite give up the corner. Dave doing like really weird, like mid ass stalls. Yeah. Yeah, Dave's got that weirdness in him. Sometimes. Sometimes a bit of normal behavior is called for. That setup. It's normal for a reason, for sure, but you gotta mix a little weirdness in, you know? Keep him on your toes. M's really struggling to get in here on uh, on stadium. Dave's giving him so much space to like bomb aerials, and M's is obliging. It's like you got that, man. Don't worry about it. No tipper up air. I thought that could have been a tipper if M's had jumped up and it tipped and M's was holding up. Yeah. Dude, and, ooh, it's this, belly uh, this F tilt, man, is is putting in fucking the hard yards. Yeah, Dave's having a good F tilt there. He's yeah, it's a good F tilt day. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, man. And Amps, he just, he really doesn't want to get hit. But I feel like he needs to try and create some opportunities for himself to uh, get some crazy strings. I agree. He should win neutral. <laughs> so he needs to be amongst <laughs> it instead of not playing it, all right? You got to get amongst it, Amps. Yeah. That's my advice. Exactly. Get Amps amongst it. Get in it. there. Get involved, you know? <laughs> get around it. Yeah. Oh, and Dave's... Give it a go. Dave's been around it. He's been around, for Ooh. sure. I wonder if there's a better punishment for down there. Oh, great Ooh, that was sick. And that's uh, so scary. Imagine if that kills. That would be so upsetting. That's like one of those bullshit ultimate kills where, like, somehow, like, something tips you at the top of the boss zone and you, and you die. Just, you don't even, like, go up. You just disappear. And Emps is so yeah. strong on lost stuff. Straight up. Emps is in his zone now. This is all he needed. He needs like one little baby hit and then yeah. fish for a rest. And you know? Exactly. Okay. Oh. Lives again. He's got the trade though. He's got the baby hit. Ned's going to throw a pound out here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anything to oh, say there it is. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Dave knows, Go, dude. Dave. <laughs> oh, man, he's ready. He popped off too. You see that? Yeah. That was a crazy pop Love off. Love Dave pop off. He Ems loves it. Well. Yeah. Ems probably popped off for Dave. Ems a big Dave yeah. fan. Well played. How can you not be, really? That was, yeah, that was a really well played set. It's crazy oh, yeah. of uh, of Amps to, you know, bring that back from the uh, brink. Not quite all the way, but and pretty good. 
have we got a treat for you, gamers in the chat? And the answer to that question is yes, we do. Uh, it's going to be Jack, aka Zai, doubles, doubles champion of, uh, of Big Cheese, and Ashcon, uh, the most famous guy at the venue apart from Josh. <laughs> oh shit, here he comes. Yeah, the, the closest to the, the yard of all people here. <laughs> That's true. The, the fewest handshakes removed. Exactly. All right, we're passing over. All right. Yep. <laughs> hello, hello. We got a good one. We get Goody and Jordy. Yeah, Goody Jordy. Oh, that's a classic. Hello, gamers. Who do you got for this one? Ooh, I think I think historically at the moment. I we, think Naruto wins this one. I think Naruto wins this one over Jordy. This is definitely Naruto set to win. It's definitely not his set to lose. <laughs> <laughs> Is this one mine? Uh, yeah. Cheers. You can see us in the cam. All Chat, right. we need a drinking game. What do we take a drink for what happens in game? All right, we're taking suggestions. We're staring at the, um, the chat right now. Dion, I need a drinking game. Please make the rules right now. Every power, power shield? That's a good one, actually. A sip every power shield? There uh, is a Falco yeah, on that's, stream. Dude, <laughs> that's, that's the boys getting blackout by like, the end of the set. <laughs> just I no wouldn't reason. want it any other way. <laughs> just getting blackouts and watching Naruto yeah. play. Yeah, like, just sitting here by the end of the set like this. like. Whoo. All right. If someone SDs to lose a game, you just neck your drink. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to need someone on, like, drink duty. <laughs> All right, so we have SDs. We have power shields. Every head nod, man. These, I don't know how these people are head nodding. Like, I've got, like... Naruto is definitely a head nodder. <laughs> no. There's no way he's not. Dude, I was watching Syndicus before. If he missed his uh, tech chase as Falcon, he was head nodding. That would have me just, like, <laughs> what do you want me to do? Oh. Every, every shine is just rude. Rupert, every shine is rude. Ooh, Goody getting legs out, arms out. The weights come off. Glasses on. Naruto. Did you see um, that Mango tweet where he was just talking about how like anyone who brings up the when Rock Lee takes the weights off versus Gara, <laughs> it's like you don't understand what that means. <laughs> 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 Every time someone's like, but he still lost. It's like you don't understand yeah. the significance of that moment. It's like for real though, that was a moment, and that's what we have. Goody. I was gonna say like from Goody's side, but he he's the favorite. <laughs> <laughs> like he's the he Gara. Gara. <laughs> he, he's Gara right now. <laughs> what he's gonna take his weights off <laughs> just to get his arms and legs broken. <laughs> oh man. Okay. Let's see. That Jordy's been playing pretty hard. I, I haven't seen any of Goody's sets this weekend, or at least today. I mean, Goody so. last week was very hot with the uh, winners bracket reset. Oh, gosh, man. In uh, in Temple. Mm -hmm. if, you, if you're a Victorian, you should come to Tempili, Tempili, whatever it's called. Sorry, Naruto, as I should oh, say. Oh, sorry, Naruto. Naruto versus Josh Man in uh, Winners Finals. But Grants took a set, but it, apparently that doesn't count as a set. So it's but a, he did take it to game... Game 10. Not game 10, game 8. Oh, game... Oh, uh, never mind, then. You know what, Naruto sucks. Okay, woo! Ran straight into that back here. Ooh, the should be a kill. Yeah, yeah. Down smash hits so far up the stage. Like, that was. That's unfair. Oh, never mind, that's unfair. <laughs> <laughs> Everything costs yeah. us, it's just unfair. <laughs> Stupid character, that's why I play. <laughs> oh, there, yeah, there we go. Gooch, Gooch is uh, plugging Temple. Oh, that's gross. Naruto now with the stock lead. It's just unfortunate that Naruto gets, like, main character buff. I don't know where I'd put Jordy. Is Jordy like... I wouldn't call him Shikamaru, but like... <laughs> <laughs> What's a character that's on like four side quests in the show? Because Jordy is in like four different brackets right now. It'd be like Neji or something. <laughs> and, but we'll see if he has the same fate as Neji after this set. Naruto is not happy yeah, about that one. And yeah, Naruto just got hit with, uh, what was it, 8 Triagram, 64 Palms? Like, you don't want that. <laughs> Any Naruto fans? 
Alright. Man, I'm like, I was talking, it was literally just the other day, me and the boys were discussing about like, <laughs> like just random things in Naruto, where it was like, that was so stupid. That was so stupid. It's like, why did Sasuke get Renegade? What? Why? That's not even like, that's not even his thing. Man, I haven't thought about that in so long. <laughs> Alright, Jordy's trying to bring this one back. Oh, the wrong direction. What? what? <laughs> How does that hit? That's unfair. That's unfair. That's stupid. <laughs> Good. Good. Naruto, Naruto. With the turnaround. <laughs> Naruto with the turnaround shrug. That's his Rasengan. <laughs> Turns around, believe it! <laughs> yeah, dude, if, he's, if he says that, I'm actually like, I'm off comms. Alright, Geordie. Geordie's favorite stage is Stadium. Actually, I think his favorite stage is Unfrozen Stadium. Oh, really? Yeah, because like, stuff like the Rock Transformation, where like, if they tech in that little spot in the right, they're just fucked. <laughs> <laughs> like, if the Falco is in front of you, you literally can't tech in any direction, you're getting out smashed. Holding it down here. <laughs> okay, alright. It's um so yeah, Jordy if Jordy loses this, or whoever loses this has to verse Ruben in um in losers, and that's the, another top eight qualifier. And Ruben has this like I think he I think he's top eight in nearly every single major he's been to, like in the past five years. So we'll see see what happens after that. Jordy's kinda of just getting run down though. Proving that he could be the Hokage right now. <laughs> like, I hope people don't worry about um, Naruto spoilers at like this point in. Uh, oh, no! oh! Oh! I felt that one in my soul. That's a rough oh, one. No! Oh no! Alright. Jordy needs to take a deep breath. That was, what was that? A minute 13. <laughs> that is. Not good. Goodies drinking performance enhancing drinks. Being Coca Cola with a full sugar in it. Coked out of his mind. Coked out of his mind. Coca Cola Fox Man. Yeah. <laughs> He's got a Coca Cola full sugar. Jordy running it straight back? So, to this day? I would have thought he would have gone anywhere else. <laughs> okay. Whoa. Don't get cheese, don't get cheese. Oh, the shine. Oh, the shine. Oh. Coverage. Yeah, this is just... Off a knockdown, Goody's just been chasing. Yeah. Not like that. Oh, this is just oh. a... Oh. <laughs> He's trying to hit a new PB this game. He's trying to break 113. Yeah. Oh, oh no. The Cena like 113. Is Nardo going to hit a PB? No, no, no. Oh, oh, no. oh he's oh. cheesing. He's cheesing. What a dog. What a rat. <laughs> Naruto is a rat. Goody is my rat. Goody is my rat. Goody is my rat. <laughs> oh, double four stop is just going be very bad for the mental. Okay. Come on, Goody. Come on, Goody. Oh, he saved him. Nice. Okay, not double four stop. I'm cheering for Jordy now. Yeah, come on, Jordy. Bring it back. Kill Naruto. You can't let him get away with this. You actually can't. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, oh, didn't get the double hit. It's like every time he's about to cook, he just rips the special out of his hand. Yeah. <laughs> it's combo over. This is my game. Yeah, it's no more. Man. What sucks is that if Jordy just played like this, like on this stock for this whole set, it's not over. It's not over. Let's see, Goody's Goody's trying to disrespect, but he's just getting hit. Oh, oh no! He's, don't take that roll in. Oh, the clay on the get up attack. Ooh. What? What? Where does that grab reach? <laughs> Where did he get that from? Grab store. That was that was bull crap. That's some fuck shit one. right there. That is some fuck shit. All right. Yeah, Sumi. That's just how it be.
that's how it be sometimes. So what's the um, the lore with the large fromage? Large fromage? How um, many of the large fromage three? So <laughs> large fromage three. I was there. I but you don't remember, remember anything. <laughs> That sounds like the so, last rush. So, so all of the big cheeses, I feel like it's the, the tournament where, because we're not running it in Victoria, where we have to, like, do all the legwork, the, the SA, SATOs and SA helpers run the whole thing, which means that we kind of just get drunk. <laughs> like, <laughs> last year was, last year was all right. I, I remember, so we were set up in a different, different hole. We're in the hole around the side now because we're in the main hole here at the St. Clair Rec Center. Um, and I think it was Sock, Sock My Son versus Nick Grands. I think Josh was over in the US or something. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, I can't remember exactly, but it was a standard tournament. I feel like Big Cheese, the reason why it's always so good is just purely off the fact that it's like the, um, the, the social side. Here. The vibes are always so good here. And like having it in a rec center means that like we also just get the opportunity to have stuff like the bleacher seats. And then you also have a huge oval at the back, so you can literally just go outside and kick a ball when you're like, okay, I'm, I'm not going to be a gamer anymore. And a bar in venue. Yeah, bar and venue. You can't beat that. You really can't. You don't have to sneak drinks in. <laughs> not that yeah, I've that, done that. That never happens. Um, it's never happened before. Respect never your will. local TO. That's don't right. sneak drinks in the venue. That's It's bad for them, and it's bad for running events again at that same venue. Definitely, if you do, take your trash out. Yeah, <laughs> at least do that. That's the bare minimum. Dude, people who leave like their cans of drinks that are obviously not sold in the venue, like out on tables, and it's like, oh, cool. They got like people have to clean this, and you go, oh, okay. People are just sneaking drinks. In. Don't do that. Um, <laughs> at least right. make it the fader raid. Yeah, <laughs> the fader raid. So they'll raid. never know. <laughs> uh, allegedly, back in the day, just uh, what 2017, 2018, it was definitely the era of just like. Oh, this place doesn't sell like alcohol at the venue. It's like we can fix that. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I can, we can get a Macca's, a Macca's like lemonade. Oh. Um, but yeah, Gucci, you're right? Chewy water, chewy water in Adelaide compared to to Melbourne. I feel. I feel like it's a uh, it got a bit of a crunch to it. <laughs> Some people prefer that. Sometimes it's not um not what they not don't want. <laughs> uh, we do have. A hold we up. Next? We're looking. We're just waiting. Uh, there's Josh Decker on winner's side. Well, uh, we'll be going to losers. I think we're going to uh, other top eight qualifiers. So I Goody made it to top eight. Decker made it to top eight. It'll be Jordy versus Ruben for losers side top eight. And Monkey versus Kaiser, it looks Ooh. like. Let's go, Kaiser. Don't make me commentate a Dave match. I can't say his name. Anytime I've tried pronouncing his tag, the Australians have yelled at me. Decker. I, I don't even want to make jokes when <laughs> we try and say it. Look, it's just because Australians, we say every ER or AR as just a hard A compared to yeah, everything <laughs> else. <laughs> uh. All right, let's see. Now, uh, our stream homie has had his headset taken away from him. He has to listen to us with his ears now and not through, <laughs> not through the sweet, sweet red audio technicas that Kaiser is using for gaming right now. This is going to be a good one. This is Double Falco. Teach Ka me about these players. As um, the, uh, Monkey is I am new. not from here. I don't know anyone. Of Monkey is new here. school. Monkey really? is like, I don't think Monkey is uh, 18. I think, I think he is like a young kid. But he's he got the H-Box Sunnies on right now, though. <laughs> yeah, he does not He's got the H-Box vibe going. Do you reckon he's playing, like, uh, Kanye through his head right now? <laughs> Maybe. But he plays Falco, so... Exactly. Oh, so he's playing... What, what does Mango listen to? I have no clue. That's a good question. <laughs> he's actually a huge Mango fan. I mean, imagine being a Falco mate and you're not a Mango fan. <laughs> it's like, like what are you doing? <laughs> what else do you have? It's like, it's like a Puff mate who hates H-Box. Yeah, it's like you're... You're on the wrong side of like your character's right. history. Fun lore. You know how uh, H-Box had the crap thrown at him? Yeah. The the rumor on the street is it was a puff who threw it. No. It was a puff mate. That's insane. <laughs> just, just, so maybe. <laughs> just looking at the one guy and being like, I hate you. <laughs> I hate you so much. <laughs> yes, that's, it's just so funny yeah. when I found that out. Because, yeah, it's like after after H-Box, it's like it's too sane. Yeah, two, two is cracked though. I've been saying that. 
Um, and then after, so after you did a number to uh, the side of the world. Two side. Yeah. What? In uh, the chess boxing event. Oh. <laughs> Two versus Spud. Dude, yeah, Spud. Look, unfortunately, Spud got fucking clapped. <laughs> Spud took the bag and ran. That was unfortunate. Oh. But yeah. Like so, we got Monkey. Monkey's new school. Monkey's been playing for I think like a year or so now. That's uh, crazy. Yeah. Only a year. I think so. I think. Based on Smash Discord, I feel like if we search back on um, Smash Discord post history, maybe we'll find some earlier messages. But, uh, but yeah, Kaizo been around for. Kaizo's a homie. Yeah, that's great. I love Kaizo. Also, the drip match on the controller. Yeah. They're color coordinated. Just, just hitting the red everywhere. Red <laughs> jacket, red headset, pink hat, red controller. That's a nice controller too. Yeah. Is that the Gundam one? Mm-hmm. Is that, oh, <laughs> a, is that a swapped out Panasonic back as well? Uh, no, the back's like a clear. Oh. I think. I can't see from here. But yeah. starting on Pokemon, the frame one, yeah, same both frame laser. Laser. In sync. So I think we're in, a, we're in for a good match. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. Kai obviously like TOing the event, running the stream and stuff. So we'll see. I think he's looking good. <laughs> Nice start off. Yeah. We'll see, like, um, I feel like, depending on the exposure that you've had, like, with Monkey, has been mainly, like, from New South Wales, but also mainly an online kind of gamer. It, like, it's the... Oh. Are there a lot of Falcos in New South Wales? Um, not anyone. New South Wales is kind of in a weird spot now. There's... Oh, my Ooh, God. Ooh, that was clean. Um, New South Wales used to have, like, the best Falcos with, like, uh, MC, who was... Like the the best Falco in Australia, um, I think Victoria kind of had the highest uh, density. We had a PR where I think we had like six Falcos on it or something, some stupid number. Uh, but yeah, it's like whether whether Monkeys had the experience playing against the kind of Falco that Kai plays like, which is like pretty safe, like very like laser heavy, very like focus on neutral, and we'll go to the very hard read, but. Well, we'll see. Like, Monkey is basically a stop down if we're attacking at one hit. Mm -hmm. Pressure. Oh. oh, there he is. I feel like his pressure is just a little too slow, you yeah. know? It's like, it's the right idea, but it's like, you're losing frames there. Yeah, 100%. It's like, if, if it's not... Is this crazy? Oh, had the right idea. Oh, so back to even. Oh. Shine's flying out everywhere. If we were doing, like chat said, and drinking every power shield, uh, not oh. every power shield, every shot, oh. far out. Ty just losing the momentum on that yeah. side. Went from like nearly a whole stock up to a whole stock down. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Yeah. It's crazy how that happened. Yeah, I was trying to think of something <laughs> and I, I fell apart real quick. Okay. Kai? Back. Oh! oh! <laughs> Damn. Alright, crowd, crowd starting to pop off over that one. Then we can see uh, the skip SSPM. So oh! oh call out. out. Oh! Good night. Kai right. smiling. Yeah, Kai smiling, standing up. Ooh, big water bottle. The water bottle? The streamer jug yeah. right there. That is a streamer jug. <laughs> Drop the orange justice. Yeah. I want to see the orange justice right uh, here. I feel like I need to see Kaiser's Fortnite dances. <laughs> <laughs> All right, headset back on. Water drank. Towel moved. All right, it's gaming time. I respect the gamers that have everything unlocked. <laughs> Water. <laughs> to how to help with wetness. It's like a um, flash in Brood War where he would have the ruler and you would measure the yeah. distance for his keyboard so it's in the exact same position every time. It's like, I respect that. Yeah. That's a no John mentality right there. Yeah. You can't be there like, oh, my hands are sweaty. You're if like, that oh. player ever John's like, nah, bro, you covered it all. <laughs> yeah. It's like, you, you have, have no excuse. You have gone to such lengths. Like, there's no. It's like, oh, you're telling me that you forgot to drink water when you're measuring out <laughs> your keyboard? Like, <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, God. 
Dude, Monkey's going crazy. He's got the crowd on his side yeah. too. Okay. <laughs> oh! oh! Dude, this. Who's this kid? Oh, there we go. Even? Ish? Power shield? Drink? I think that might have been second there. Ah. Ooh, straight to ledge. Oh. It's like <laughs> I feel like FD. I don't know about you. I'm an FD hater. I hate this stage. <laughs> I, I think I think it's watered down melee. Um, except in doubles because it worked well for double spaces. Oh. But like, I feel oh, yeah. like. It's one of those stages where it's just so heavily swung on like this one big combo, and if it goes beyond that, it's like it just becomes Marvel versus Capcom at that point. Yeah. <laughs> oh. It's like I'm playing my platform fighter, and the only platform is the stage. <laughs> I think uh, these guys are going down here. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. I hope. Oh no, we have to fit. Oh. That is the neck to drink angle, oh. unfortunately. <laughs> you Chat hate to see that one. So uh. unfortunate, because I feel like all these games have been going in Kai's favor and then just. Just the, the just, one thing. Just slips right out of his hands. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that. Basically, just finishing a whole can of hard solo. Oh. <laughs> so some good Falco did us here. Monkey, yeah. Is it Monkey? <laughs> uh, monkey, Monkey. Mon monkey. I think monkey. people just call him Monkey. Monkey holding it down, though. Oh, that was some odd Ooh. pressure. I feel like Falco pressure is sometimes just funny where like if someone's expecting the real fast pressure and you do the real slow pressure, it like just from like messing up your timing, it like it makes people just make mistakes. Because they're like, oh you're going slow, I want to do something, and then they get hit by like the second giant and you're like, cool. Like great, I'm my bad. I not looking happy right now. Well, the smiles enough. have gone. Yeah. It's vanished from his face. <laughs> his smile, his happiness. Oh, it's coming back though. Yeah, I saw that. It's a little smirk <laughs> coming through. A little smirk coming back in there. <laughs> okay. Dude, Monkey is just like. I think this is their first major. I think it's first major. Really? Yeah. Like, unless unless he went to like an um. Oh, wow. Just oh, yeah. Doesn't make it back. All right, Kai. Kai waiting on platform. Doesn't want to deal with what's it called? Respawn shenanigans. Jump over the laser. This is, I feel like Kai needs to get just a big combo and just try to even up the game since it's possible. The more percent he takes here, even if he takes the stock of Monkey, it's just like, uh, what, one big hit is just gonna kill him. Ooh, cheese? Oh. Large cheese denied. <laughs> cheese denied. Lactose intolerant. <laughs> Not allowed. Take the lactate. Yeah. Oh. Ooh. Take him. Keep it going. Oh. Oh. Kaiser. Crowd's going bananas. B A N A N A S. Oh. Monkey, oh, and that's it. And monkey's oh. with the oh, what a pop-up. Pop Absolutely disappears from the camera. Oh, you can see him in the background. And he's running and he's hugging in the background. Kaiser, Kaiser shrugging to the camera. This is what oh. it is. Yo, shout outs to streaming. Yeah. And also making it deep in the bracket. 100%. I feel like Kai always like kind of gets deep in the bracket. At least like in Big Cheese, we'll at mm -hmm. least get to the point where it's like, oh, like obviously it's like streaming or doing the whole event kind of thing does make you and like affect how you play. But like he's still putting in a good effort. <laughs> he did just get popped off on, on like a 3 0 though, which is. He was in the splash zone. Yeah, he was. <laughs> that was a rough one. You hate to see it. Maybe Monkey's Naruto. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. In, here in South Adelaide. In South Australia. In South Adelaide. South Adelaide. <laughs> South Australia. He is Naruto. How many Naruto's do we have in the bracket? <laughs> <laughs> uh. I'm watching. 
What's happening over there? Is that KOF? Damn, I don't know. Real fighting game. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. What do we got? We got like ultimate on the other side. Well, Mortal Kombat is hidden in a in a dark room in a dark corner because it's R eighteen. Um, we're DQing Geordie for needing to go get a water. <laughs> oh, making that hard solo was like. <laughs> 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 I felt better. What do we have? Microsoft J. Looks oh, versus like Ruben. Geordie versus Ruben. Ooh. It's um, a bleep bloop. Bleep bloop. Geordie beat Ruben before, like in uh, in pools. So it's whether he can pull it through to a game five set. Ruben, notorious for always making it to top eights. Can he keep it going? Can he keep it going? That's yeah, a Ruben's a homie. Let me Ruben's stay at his house. Yeah. Uh, first time uh, I was here. On the Thursday. Super friendly guy. That house is that house is crazy. It's so sick. He's oh, rolling in. Look at him. He's <laughs> he's pulling up. He's got his sunnies on. <laughs> where's the Ruben cheering squad though? Yeah, where's where's Dice Boys? I want to sign. Yeah, where? Uh, what do you want? Do you want Nangang? Oh, one of them. We want. Oh. <laughs> there we Thank go. You. All right. We have Nangang. And, and, and rock, rock hard. <laughs> you can take this one back. My right? favorite is, uh, what is it? What is it, the Yobs one or is it the Bogart? Yeah, the Yobs one. Oh! oh! No. We're throwing signs around. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is what we're doing. This is my favorite right, one. Janae <laughs> said 16 Yobs last night. What's your excuse? What's, what's your excuse? That's what Johnny, I'm saying. What will your excuse be? <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> 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 oh. All right. Do these two have a history? Um, their history is that Ruben has never beaten him on land. But so only net play. Net play is a different beast. <laughs> but on land, I think they have played like a good handful of times, probably like four or five times. And Ruben has never won. And in like, um, I think it was a, I can't remember if it was a 2 0 or not, in um, what's it called? In pools, but. Going in Yoshi's. Oh, this matchup seems so brutal. I cannot imagine that, like. Just, this is not fun at Samus, right? <laughs> like, you kind of sit there and it's like, okay, all my moves are slow, my projectiles come out slower, my projectiles get beaten by his aerials. Like, Especially starting on this stage, too. Yeah, like, what space do you have to, like... But Nangs, yeah. he doesn't pick... He doesn't strike me as the, we'll camp you out on Dreamlight Samus. No. <laughs> just seems anti his energy. He just, uh... I feel like he's pretty aggressive for like a Samus, but also that. Oh yeah, he made it back. Oh, that was just too low. Yeah. Man. Oh, I had to get around everything. I guess he's still low enough, but like, damn. He went for a grab and just got fucking tilted for it. Already going for some Samus or like floaty specific tech with the double shine for knockback second. <laughs> he just <laughs> he just down it through his, uh, his missile. <laughs> like all right. Oh, and can he just? Oh. Yeah, it's just this is a rough matchup, and Jordy's just like is good at running it. So. Ooh. <laughs> The boy's talking about not bow guarding the bow guard. <laughs> bow guarding his stocks. Just for Reed. Alright. He's gonna just fish the down tilts. Oh! Oh! oh he taunts it. Oh, he dies immediately. But Take those. Yeah. Uh, that's, a, that's a clean, clean full stock that he just made back from doing nothing. 
Alright, now will Geordi be tilted by that SD? Or will he just stick to his game plan? Like, working before. Just have to keep going. Oh! oh setting him into the oblivion. Oh! That's a rough one. Okay. Geordi with no fear to just run into the danger zone. Yeah. It's just like the Samus sitting there holding down. It's just like, not scared, not afraid. Down here wins. Oh my god, just jumps over the missile with a dare. Oh no. That's oh. it. Oh. Oh. oh! He tried to be swag! If he loses this now. Oh, reverse dash attack. Not a strong hit. But one good hit will. Oh, surely. What? What? Surely, I feel like surely you're there. Surely you're near there. Oh. I'm just worried. <laughs> one hit sends Falco off stage. Just. Oh. Shine? Oh. He can't. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? No fear in the danger zone. Yeah. Oh, oh, that could have just would have absolutely ended. Wow. Oh, uh. What are you doing? Oh. Oh, this is it. Oh. Okay. Ruben has no fear in grabbing. Uh, yeah, no. But I that, feel like he grabs more than a Samus would in one game than in the entire set. Hundred percent. But that's what kind of like against Monkey. That's what got him fucked. <laughs> he like he was sitting there like he threw out a couple grabs, and what happened was that like Monkey just jumped over it over and over, and just like ah, oh, this is a free axe smash. All right, you're just sitting there deer in headlights. Jordy's saying, let's run it back. If he didn't SD, that would have been his game. All right, I'm I'm a very um. I don't like going back to the same stage that I lost on. I think I like the change of um, change of scenery. Like obviously it depends on the stage and like the matchup and stuff. Oh. But like, I feel like I have bad juju on a stage once I lose on it. You know, it's like, oh, I've lost on battlefield. It's like as Fox, like it's a good stage. <laughs> but like, oh, I'm gonna go fucking play fought or something now. Especially right there where like a similar thing just happened again. It's like, oh no. Yeah. What is going on? But yeah, it's like literally similar thing. It's just the, the bad juju sticks with you. Mm -hmm. Oh, we didn't expect him to. <laughs> it <actually laughs> did. Yeah. Ooh. Is yeah, Ruben in, the only Samus in the like area? In oh, in, in the, uh, SA, yes. Um, but in Australia, we have like one or two. I think the other one is here, Tid. Mm -hmm. Um. And I feel like maybe one more, but it's just not a common character. We struggle with Sheiks as well, I feel. I feel like we only have like two or three sh like good Sheiks in Australia. Raw S smash on the edge. You're just crazy. The, the raw 0% and just like... To the right yeah. too when you're <laughs> the stage. Oh. Alright, Ruben's up like half a stock. Oh, he's trying to catch the uh, the Geordie instant jump. Samus makes no noise when she dies off the floor. So. This is... It, oh, <laughs> what a call out. So scary. Damn, he tech that so easily. That was... Maybe the most ambitious grab. <laughs> of all time. Yeah, like Geordie's like, on top ladder still. <laughs> <laughs> oh, tries to catch him dropping down from platform. No dice, mate. No dice. Oh, this is. Oh, I blame Snapback. Oh, yeah, it seems like it. Alright, the crowd coming alive, and that's just... Oh! 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 How did the, the grapple miss? Uh, if you're too close to ledge, I think it, it just dies. Really? Yeah. I think you have to be like a decent amount, like a, a slight bit away so that it comes out. I'll let chat correct me on that one if they're, if they're smarter than me. But... 
Ain't coming that bright. Hit him. Hit him. Too many yobs. Yeah, well, it's too many yobs. I have too many yobs. Oh, that was a heartbreaker right there. What's a yob? I'll leave that to your imagination. <laughs> what? <laughs> Riddle me this, chat. What do you think Ruben had 16 of on a Saturday night? <laughs> <laughs> Good times. <laughs> yeah. He just simply had a good time. He had 16 good times on a, on a Saturday. Okay. That's it. Unless. Oh, it's just out. Yeah, the, the Samus, like. What's it called? The wall jumps? Ooh, jeez. Someone's howling. Yeah. Chat. Chat. Uh, <laughs> the crowd's going crazy somewhere else in the venue. Right. <laughs> Double drink. Yeah. If we had anything. I'm just mind blown by the shield drop up there. Yes, he's doing Marth right there. Oh my god, the down smash catching through the platform. Dead? Huh? I don't know if the I don't know if people can catch that, but it, they just started yelling Geordie is like a melody. Alright. Ruben has a habit of just holding onto his charge shot for ever. I think I've seen him shoot two. I feel like I've never seen him shoot one actually. It's just is it just to be scary? Ooh, way dash back down smash. Ooh, falling down. Oh, nice. wow. Wow. <laughs> what a good trade there. Nice. In the stocks. Oh, just a bit too slow on the reaction there. And Samus' roll is so bad. Custom combo. Still alive. I'll just jump and shoot. I'll just straight up <laughs> I jump know, and I would, bang. I would have let that thing rip so much longer ago. I, yeah. I feel like once I have it charged up, it's it's like not even like a, oh, I'm thinking. It's like, oh, they're in a position. Bang. Bang, bang, bang. <laughs> it's a Falco laser to me. <laughs> Ooh, Jordy sent a shield smash just though. Oh. <laughs> Platform height is awkward. Hey, Jordy held that down there. Yeah, fine. Right. Spacey shield too strong. Ooh. Any rockets? Ooh. Short end. Damn, what a short end. I feel like Jordy was doing everything right in that, uh, what's it called, in the recovery there. Yeah, a lot of patience to just dodge all the small obstacles. Yeah. Literally just playing like a bullet hell game <laughs> when you're off stage. <laughs> <laughs> Look, that's a good spot Finally let it rip. Yeah, I mean, it was a good time. It worked. It's like against Falco and stuff as well. It's like if he's shooting lasers at you, the delay, like the, the end light that you have from shooting out the... The charge shot is like completely cancelled. And also, they're shooting laser. Like, they won't be able to do this. <gasps> oh, oh, my God. God. Attack barely saving him there. Does that kill? Not Fox. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. God. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> no bias here. No bias. Well, taking it back though. Both players choosing to run it back the set. Yeah. Oh, oh wow. Quick first one out here for Nates. Well, let's see. So, so Jordy won on his run back to Yoshi's. Mm -hmm. And it's looking. <laughs> maybe oh, a bit. Oh my god! Oh! oh. Holy crap! That was... It's looking like both players might be 
winning on their counter pick. Oh, and they they rerun back to a counter pick. In that case, it's uh it's not looking good for Jordy for the next game. Oh, Man. popped up. Oh, just needs to close it out. Jordy has been so good that whenever what. defensive play is that? <laughs> he got like an 330 something percent off that. So clutch. <gasps> oh, Ooh, he just didn't get his air right out. Okay, get off me. Alright, Jordy, one full stop down. Invincibility going from Ruben. He's getting Jordy shielding. <laughs> Wow. Is he doing a, a jab one? Oh my god, that was. Oh. oh no, he got too greedy. Let's. Okay. Let's see. Will Jordy close this one out and make it even in the stock count? DI. Okay. But I think Jordy's making a good idea, like a good good decision to Oh in a weird angle to thinking it back. Okay. Aerial interrupt. Get back on the ledge a bit quicker. Dead. They're slowing it down a lot, I feel like, this game. It's getting a bit... The, the boys are taking a bit more time to make their decision. And, and like, Ruben's not getting hit as hard as he was in the first game or two. Mm -hmm. But, back here. Rocket, rocket, missile, even. I played the Metroid games. Wow. Wonderful stuff. Charge shot up. Ruben never shoots them, man. Just, just send it early. <laughs> what are they gonna do? Maybe taking the battle to the top five on the one. Yeah. Oh, what a call out! Oh, the... yeah. I get that. <laughs> and oh, down air. Missile? No. Oh, I think this is it. What a shot in! Bang! Game 5. Game 5. Game 5. Damn. What stage are we going to? Is Jordy gonna take it to Pokies? Pokies gives him the ability to do those missile, like the missile loops. We're talking FTC points. Oh! Oh! oh. oh. Quick hit. Dude, Ruben, is so Ruben, brutal. he always gets a top eight. Will he do it again? Or will Jordy ruin this streak? Will Ruben finally win? In land, he's one stock up, but it's not a big stock. Jordy's, Jordy's ripping this stock back. He does not want to go down a full stock. And some, oh, no grab, no nothing. Oh my god. Oh, the nair. How does he jump out? How does he jump out? He's just too afraid to get into this spot zone there. Yeah. Oh, F tilt, F tilt range, F tilt range. Ooh. Jab two from Samus. Whoa, dodge that one. I feel like Jordy might need to get a bit more. I don't know. It's it's, it's well and good to like get this chip damage, but like he needs a he needs a hit. It's that hard spot where it's like he needs a strong hit and nothing. Oh, oh. 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 Ruben always does it. He always does it. Oh. 
All right, there we go. There's a strong hit. Jordy's trying to rip this one back. Come on. Oh. Oh my oh, god. He, he had a chance. He had a chance to just throw a down air out and it was like. Even game. Look, he's, char he's charging him down now. It's working. Don't treat Samus like a real character. <laughs> like. As long as you play around the. Um, oh wow. Oh wow. Even sucks. As long as you play around the up B, like range out of shield. Like, Samus' options are pretty limited. It's it is fine. always scary, though. Yeah, as soon as... one leg swoop and you're... Yeah, that bird a... is far. <laughs> and that bird does not have a good recovery. Oh, the nice... Oh! Jordy! Jordy went from, like, two stocks down to... Oh, my Two stocks God. down to one stock up. Jordy making a stanky face. He knows what the position that he's in. He's trying to make top eight. He's trying to make Ruben lose his streak. <laughs> Oh, the crowd. The crowd is conflicted right now. <laughs> Jordy not letting up at all. Oh, man. Is it last stock situation? Oh, my. Day it's a last, last stock last situation. Stock. It's a last stock situation. This is a qualifier for top eight. Ruben's got a full charge shot. Will he let it rip? Jordy's slowing down the pace, though. He's making sure that the lasers are keeping him in place. Ruben is trying to get it down. Oh, it's talking laser. Okay, there's a power shield. Oh, it's so stressed. Oh, he gets grabbed. All the back air. Oh, oh, he air dodges. He air dodges. Oh, both of them are kind of just throwing stuff out. Oh, Jordy's sticking to his game plan. Jordy taking it a lot slower now. Yeah. This. Is he gonna let the charge shot rip? That is where we're at. Oh, the DI! It's Jordy, Jordy deciding no. He's so afraid. He did not want yeah. to go there. I, hell no. He did not have that dog in he, him right there. No, there's no dog. There's a tiny puppy at best. <laughs> at best. Maybe a cat. Oh! oh. Charge shot! Oh, he just, just doesn't do anything! Oh, bro! Nine gang big scream from the crowd! Oh! Is there a charge shot? Oh, oh it's a charge shot! But he misses! Oh! oh! And is this it? Is this it? Oh! 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 <laughs> How the hell does he do it? He's oh. broken his streak of losing to Jordy at land, and he makes tough eight. He simply just. Oh! He's simply just better. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> that was crazy. <laughs> Amazing. Okay. Well, folks, thanks for watching the Top 24 Bracket, everyone. Uh, we'll be heading into Top 8 uh, soon-ish. We're, like, about, like, 30, 40 minutes behind schedule right now. Uh, just because we were supposed to be starting Top 8 at 3.30. It's now 3.40, and we were hoping to give people, like, a 30-minute break. So I'm going to, like inform people what the situation is we'll work out what's going to work best for them so that they are like ready to go for top eight at some point so give us a little while maybe we'll be back in like 30 minutes how's that sound all right that all sounds right. all right thanks for watching everyone and thank you zai and nashcon for commentating um, we'll be back with top eight very shortly all right stay tuned folks peace out